Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, depending on where you are, and welcome to Quizzlemania 3, Bigger, Better, Badder, the showcase of the Amorons, the greatest spectacle in all of sports infotainment. It has been a 24 hours. There has been mass releases. Uh, as we found out only a few hours ago, the greatest ring announcer ever in the history of wrestling, uh, Howard the, the Fink, Finkel, has passed away. It is a sad anti-WWE time. And if you want more information on all that, check out our extensive coverage on WrestleTalk. But this is is Quizzlemania. And the purpose of this show is to take your mind off the world's myriad miseries. That's just what we'll do. I'm your host, Adam, Mike the Quiz, Quizanin Blompier. And I'm going to be holding this quiz together as our four roided wrestle boys jostle for points in ways equally studious and studly. Without further ado, let us meet our players. First off, Ollie. Hi, Ollie. How's it going? Yeah, pretty good. Pretty good, Adam. I'm holding up well here. Yeah, feels like it. In Quizlemania 1, obviously, you came last. Uh, that's okay. You were unused to the game. We all were unused to the game. In Quizlemania 2, you came last, and now it's a streak. So yeah. where do we go from here? Up. Has to, right? What happens, if, to. You come, what happens if you come last for a third time? <laughs> I don't know. I, I, I haven't thought about that. It's, uh... Okay, so next up it is making his first ever appearance in Quizomania. He bloody loves the quiz. It's Laurie. Hi, Laurie. Hello. Hi, Adam. Pleasure to be here. Uh, as you can see, I'm taking this quiz immensely seriously. I've put glasses on. I've sorted up about wrestling. What I don't know about wrestling, I don't know about wrestling. Getting a bit of a weird echo. Where are you recording from, mate? Uh, my Triviatorium is where I keep all my trivia. Sounds and like a bathroom. Not, it's not a bathroom. Just pan down for me. It's just not, it's not, it's not a bathroom. Oh my God. Oh it's my God. It's not a bathroom. He's taking this seriously. I'm taking it. All right. Uh, we do obviously have a special guest every week here at Quizlemania and making his first appearance on the show. It is Brian Zane, everybody. Hey, how you doing? Uh, I wanted to get in on the spirit of everyone drinking things and I didn't have any drinks in hand. Anyway, I'm happy to be here for Quizlemania. It's really fun. I'm really excited. Awesome. So on, on your channel, Wrestling With Regret, uh, you cover a huge expanse of wrestling history. Everyone in this quiz is very afraid of you. Uh, is that knowledge, the knowledge that stays in your brain or is it a research it then forget it sort of situation? It is a gift and a curse. Yeah, there's things that, you know, uh, there's things that I've like studied for this channel that, you know, a couple years later just leaves my mind so hopefully i'll be able to go into those deep nooks and crannies in my brain in the mind palace and i'll be able to hopefully find some relevant information everyone thinks i'm like really good at wrestling trivia i don't think i'm that good when i'm under the pressure i don't think i've won any of these trivia challenges yet so we'll see how it goes well if it's any consolation i mean actual knowledge means very little in quiz mania and final question what's your favorite fast food franchise that's gotta be burger king man home of the whopper yeah good choice all right and finally he is your reigning defending Quizzlemania champion. It is Randy, Andy Datsun. Hi, Andy. Oh, sorry, hi. Yeah, what, what? Uh, so you are our, our champion. You are the uh, the current holder of the prestigious Quizzlemania trophy that still hasn't arrived through the post. We're, we're yeah. working on that. But congratulations, Andy. Obviously, everyone is very upset that you are still the champion. Uh, everyone still thinks that you are the under cheater and this is your streak. Mm. Uh, so much so that you've actually uh, introduced a certain little stake for this game. Would you like to tell the people I about have. that? I have. Yes. Well... Uh, much to my girlfriend's horror, I promised you all that I would shave my hair if I lost, and I forgot to tell her before I promised you. Um, and then I told her, and she said, can we break up for about two weeks till it grows back? All right, so let's get on with the game. Those are our players. Let's not forget they are competing not only for Andy's prestigious Quizlemania trophy, the richest prize in our sport, but in true Piper versus Adonis fashion, the hair is up for grabs. And I can confirm that the winner will be getting a sandwich bag full of Andy's hair posted to them as a prize. And before we kick into this show, this week's Quizlemania is brought to you by da -da 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 -da, getting it up. Uh, hey, the WrestleMania. Uh, Wrestle Talk magazine. There it is. Uh, 
the new edition is out, not in shops because of the world, but you can order it from WrestleMerch.com. This edition includes a brand new fantasy booking from this guy. I'm pointing at me. Right, enough shilling. On with the show. Here are our players. Uh, so, uh, as we all know, WrestleMania 3 was host of one of the greatest, uh, most prestigious, most lauded moments in all of wrestling history. So, Quizlemania 3 will try and start with something equally lauded. It's whose nips are these? <laughs> It's back, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, you you all demanded it. It's back. So, uh, obviously, I am going to be showing you guys a close-up picture of uh, oh. a male wrestler's uh, nipplage. Uh, you are then going to tell me who that wrestler is. If you get it right, there are three points up for grabs. So, there are, th uh, there are 10 questions, 30 points total for this round. Let's start off with some beauties. Whose nips are these? Ooh. Ooh. Oh, I know so. those nips. Uh, <laughs> I, I'm just going to say it's WrestleTalkMerch.com. What did I say? Merch. I was thinking that too. To be fair, the advert <laughs> is wrong. Ah. The advert says WrestleMerch.com. Look, 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 it's like my head is the <laughs> is the body. <laughs> I hate it. We're talking a three-headed monster. All right, I'm going to start while you're writing down your answer. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to start writing, uh, reading out some of these super chats. Tanner Goss do, uh, donated $9.99. How do you guys feel about the mass releases? Uh, pretty much how everyone feels. What a horrible thing for a company to do to its employees <laughs> during a terrible time. We hope that they all go on to bigger and better things. Uh, Small Afro Games donated $4.99. Love you all. Even Adam, who, uh, when I had asked in a Twitter group that Brian had put us in if he wanted to collab with me, he left the chat. Oh, uh, I'm sure that wasn't personal. Uh, and then Three finally, years ago uh, was a wild time. I'm sorry. Exactly. Uh, Jobber.jj496, <laughs> Ollie Davis' number one fan, says, Some good news 2020. Ro Roman Reigns and his wife expecting twins. Zack Ryder t-shirt, number one seller on pro wrestling tees. I'd like to thank Wrestle Talk for interviewing wrestlers who have been released from WWE. All right. So, question is, whose nips are these? We're going to start with the reigning champion, Andy. Are those Vince McMahon's nips? Vince McMahon's nips. Laurie? I went for... The Undertaker. The Undertaker. Ollie. Those are the overly tanned nips of Ric Flair. Ric Flair and Brian Zane. I also have Ric Flair as my answer. Ric oh. Flair. I can Ric confirm that those belong to Ric Flair. Oh. Very, very good. Right. Ollie. Two sides are, of ham. You are joint <laughs> in the lead. I'm so proud of you. This is my one. This is my one. I can, can feel, feel it. it. Oh, oh, it's it's oh, my. The who's streets next? are going to reverse. The next is whose nips are these? Ooh. Ooh. Flame Incorporated has donated twenty dollars. Adam, you are the reason I found what culture than wrestle talk than wrestling with regret. You are the reason I got back into wrestling from someone who suffers from mental illness and depression. I want to say thank you for keeping me going. You are more than welcome. Uh, Jobber J dot JJ four nine six Ollie Davis number one fan TM uh, said Quizzlemania should have a side name. The Quizzle Bunch. Question for Ollie. How's the oh question for Ollie? How's the bread? <laughs> yeah, bread went really well over the weekend. It was a good loaf. Thank you. I learned from my mistakes. That's fantastic. Matthew McFadden, uh, five bucks. Uh, roses are red. Chopper shakes those hips. Titus O'Neill kissed his son on the lips. Fantastic. <laughs> Whose nips are these? We're going to start. We're going to go in reverse order this time. Let's start with Brian Zane. All right. Well, I think those are Photoshop because they're not quite as pointy in that picture as they are in real life. But I have to say uh, Jinder Mahal. Jinder Ooh. Mahal. Ollie Davis. I first wrote down Farouk and then I changed it to Titus O'Neill. I think I made a mistake. O'Neill. Laurie. I went for Farouk. Farouk. Randy. Jinder Mahal. Jinder Mahal. He's absolutely running away with it. Those were Jinder Mahal's Damn nipples. It. A little visual reminder. He was once WWE champion. Whose nips are these? Oh, that's a tricky Ooh. one. These are, these are tricky nips. I don't Hairy mind nips. telling you. 
Uh, American Savage Randy Dragon gave us two bucks. Give them hell, lads and ladettes. Hashtag Kurt Angle Hero. Kurt Angle AM dot Hero. Mm. Uh, Flame Incorporated, five bucks. Question for Brian. What happened to the stories from the Invasion series you had on Wrestle Talk? It went two videos and nothing. Yeah. Uh, oh, wow. Yeah. That's a blast from the past. <laughs> Thanks for reminding me. I guess I got to catch up on that. Um... <laughs> okay, Brian. I accidentally we've, removed we've everyone from the chat. That's sorry enough of your that. chat, Brian. <laughs> so sorry. sorry. I'm sorry. so sorry, Brian. That was a mechanical difficulty. We've got over 4,000 people looking wow. at Nick right now. That's wow. fantastic. Uh, so uh, let's go back the other way. Randy, whose nips are these? I believe those are Lars Sullivan's nips. Ooh. They are Lars Sullivan. How about Laurie? I wrote uh, Lars Sullivan, crossed it out, and wrote Sammy Zane. Sammy Zane. I've Ollie. gone for Mitch Bennett. I mean, Lars Sullivan. I, I <laughs> definitely mean <laughs> Lars Sullivan. That's the only Brian place Zane. I know him from. Uh, I'm going to go with Sammy on this one. Sammy's my pick. All right. So two for Lars, two for Sammy uh, can confirm uh, that they were, in fact, yeah. <laughs> they were Lars Sullivan's. Congratulations. Very bastard. I know uh, that. I know that chest anywhere. Just to let you all know, uh, currently, Ollie, Andy, and Brian all have six points, and Laurie, you've got nil point right mm -hmm. now. Uh, well, you get two but, points. But I do have glasses, so there's that. <clears throat> do you get a point for each nipple, Adam? You get three points for correct answer. Oh wow. Yeah, it's it. Oh, there's oh. there's so many so many points in this game. It really should be two points, shouldn't it? Just for theme. Anyway, <laughs> whose nips are these? Ooh. Oh no! Huh. Start recordings. Given it's ten pounds. Hey, Adam, your hair reminds me of an ice gem. Remember that? I do remember <laughs> those. Those were great. Um, uh, also, I just wanted to say thank you for all the work you put into this. It's fantastic distraction. Go for it, Andy. Are you? Wait, hang on a second. Hang on a. <laughs> Andy, your he is cheating. He is cheating. I have ice gems. That is crazy. I, do you know what? Yeah, he's my reading hand... the chat. My hands are shake. What? You just read it out. <laughs> <laughs> bring it back. Bring it back. Were well, those meant to be a bribe? For what? For 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 the win. Yeah. Can yeah, we have yeah, the nips no, back? Generally, my yeah, hands we, are. Can we have shaking. the nips back? Because I haven't chosen Sorry. someone yet. Sorry, guys. Please, please answer me. Whose nips are these? Whose nips are these? Whose? Oh nips my god! Are I know these. I think I know whose nips these are. Come on, guys. You know whose nips these are. Come on, guys. I believe in you. All right, Ooh. Brian. Tell us. This whole shot in the dark. Um, I don't know why I thought of it, but I thought of Joey Mercury. Joey yeah. Mercury. <laughs> Those are deep cut nips. I don't know. Uh, the uh, long Ollie, hair. Ollie, what are we talking? I think I think this is early NXT Baron Corbin. Ooh. The Ooh. hair going Ooh. down the front. Yeah. Oh, interesting, Laurie. Uh, I went for Seth Rollins, but thinking it might be Tyler Black Seth. Oh, don't even count. more of a deep cut. Mm. Uh, for similar reasons to Ollie, but different. Uh, I've gone for Adam Cole's nips. Adam Cole's Ooh. nips. Adam Cole's babies. I can confirm that they are, in fact, Shinsuke Nakamura's oh! nips. Okay. If you were thinking NXT, you were along the right lines, but not quite on those lines. I went for the hair down the front as well. He, do, he does have hair, to be fair. You were right about that. Four and a half thousand people now looking at these nips. Whose nips are these? Oh, hairy oh, nips on this round. I, I, I know. I Well, I know what the internet craves. Um, <laughs> let's oh, see. Man. Oh, there are super chats. Al Auer. Uh, Jos, Joswin uh, donated five uh, euros, I want to say. I'm here for the best streak in current wrestling. Oh, and I hope Andy wins too. Um, <laughs> Master Legic27, I once wished Andy a hell and a smell punishment, but my God, is that handsome boy improving and winning my heart. Mark J uh, De Ter Ter says, is Andy going to make it a three-peat? Andy, are you no, going to make it a three-peat? No, I don't know whose nips these are. Um, Teela Gaming Channel, uh, thanks guys for keeping us informed about everything going on. Shout out to all the people putting their health at risk for others. Heart emoji. Uh, absolutely. Uh, Bobby Ross, two bucks. Ollie always loses because he hasn't got his jacket. Whose nips are these? Randall. So uh, uh, I haven't got an answer. Uh, Jerry Lawler. Jerry Lawler. Uh, a shot in the dark. Laurie? 
Uh, I've gone for Hansen or whichever Eric Ivar, whichever one he is now. Hansen. Ollie. I have gone for Cesaro. Oh, Not we had confident. Cesaro's nip last time. No, oh, seen, you're right. You've seen right. Cesaro has Cesaro. beautiful nips. No, They're no, giant, no, 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 no. giant areolas. Cesaro's, yeah. yeah, Cesaro's nipples way bigger than that, man. You're right. And of course, I have no idea who it is either, but if I had to pick, I'd have to say Ruru, Rusev. Ah, the Ru. Mm -hmm. The chest was too light. Poor one out for Rusev. This is a, it's a difficult, difficult time for all of us because no one's got the fact that these were the nipples of a southern boy with some farmers. Oh, oh, I would never that's have got weird. That. The nips looked bigger, like, like, like more heavy. They're wide, like aren't they? Yeah. A, heavy set, wide. a heavy set nipple. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Look like. He's got wide farmer's nipples. All right. This is hard. Uh, guy community. <laughs> the guy community. The guy community. Those nips are as flat as he believes the earth to be. <laughs> Who nips are these? Whoa. Whoa. Oh, man. You're going to get Hello. a lot of Adam. Mm. Whose nips are these? Wow. They I are mean, pronounced. There's, there's only oh, one. I was going to say. Yeah, there's only one male wrestler with borderline <laughs> lady boobs. One is a remarkable different colour to Chris the other Jericho. one. <laughs> One's mm, a got, he's other. got like uh, heterochromatic nipples. <clears throat> it, yeah, and, and they, they're, they're looking different ways. It's like a lazy eye. It looks like Adam, like Mona Lisa Adam follows you around the room. Or... <laughs> and which, which wrestler has a lazy eye? It's not a hint. Uh, Do, Donato, Donato Hunter, or Donato... Uh, Ollie, I believe you cannot come in last today. You have a believer in the crowd. Thanks, ma'am. Scott McClellan says, okay, to make things more fun, as we have two streaks on the line, hair versus hair, Andy versus Ollie. Yes, should we? Should we? Should we? L Laurie told me in private that if he loses, he loses. He has to shave his beard off. <laughs> oh, so man. every everyone's putting their hair on the line. Yeah, I'll shave my chest hair. Oh well, Brian. I guess I guess you're in it by association now. Yeah, Fantastic. Apparently. Well done, Great. everyone. Put your uh, eyelashes on the line, Brian. We are occasionally <laughs> we are occasionally sponsored by a ball shaving company. So maybe there's maybe there's an integration in here. I You've am got to in love that merge yeah. marketing. All right, uh, Laurie. <laughs> let's start with you this time. Whose nips are these? Lashley. Where is it? There, Lashley. Lashley. He says, Ollie. Whose nips? I don't are these? think lashes are that big. They're only big E's. Surely we've had big E. Oh Big my God, e. really? Randy, whose nips are these? Uh, Bobby Lashley. Bobby Lashley. Brian, whose nips are these? Uh, I think it's the man with the best set of tits in wrestling, uh, Triple H, and they even <laughs> drill a sledgehammer with yeah. nipples. I think you've done a Luke. <laughs> very, very, very good. Uh, can confirm these nips belong. It turns out everyone's racist, but Brian, it's Triple no. H. No. I know that tan anywhere, Jack. <laughs> You oh, know man. your hunter. You know your hunter boobs. I'm so proud. Yeah. I, oh, have very, I have a very vivid memory growing up. Like, I was like eighth grade watching wrestling and Triple H <laughs> and China making their entrance. My dad walks in and this is his comment. Triple H and China. Women with huge breasts. Men with huge breasts. <laughs> always <laughs> resonated with me. So that's why I always have an association. That I don't want to see the chat right now. That is such <laughs> a specific I'm nostalgia. sure you can, Andy. Hey, hey now. Come on. He's putting his hair on the line for you people. Uh, right. Uh, let's move on from y'all uh, not being able to see color and move on to these nips. <laughs> Whose nips are these? Ooh. Well, they're Cesaro we like, but I'm not going to put that again. Whose nips are these? Uh, Berkey uh, said Ollie the Jobber. Uh, Gaston Langlet Rivera says, thank you for distracting us during these times. You are more than welcome. Honestly, it distracts us just as much as it distracts you. Uh, Ronnie Jones says, do you guys think Rowan should join the Dark Order if possible? Oh, and would Slater work in TNA with Rhino as a tag team? Mm. I, I can only, I, I mean, I hope these guys find work. I, we, we all do. Like, um, they are all very, very, very talented people. Uh, Patricio Hernandez says, let's go Zane. Fantastic. Uh, donating a hundred Mexican dollars to your cause, Brian. That's absolutely fantastic. All Thank right. Uh, let's no, see. Wait, sorry, sorry. I, uh, I think it, go, don't go to me first. So I don't, I don't, I'll do whatever. I don't care. Let's go to Brian first. <laughs> oh, Brian, who's Nipson? Well, uh, Ollie didn't want to do it. So I decided to do it instead. I'm going to pick Cesaro. Cesaro. Interesting. Ollie. I couldn't think of anything. So I just put Cesaro. <laughs> Cesaro. Laurie. I feel like Cesaro is the only pick. Cesaro and Randall. Uh, Jim Ross. 
<laughs> I, don't, I don't know, and I don't think it's Cesaro. I, I just don't know. Uh, I mean, Randy's <laughs> wrong, and so is everyone else. Mm. They're Finn Balor's oh, nips. Oh, oh, come on. Of course they're Finn Balor's nips. They are, oh, they're the nips stupid. of a fighting Irish. Um, he's, yeah, big. Bigger it's, than expected. Extraordinary than nips. That's exactly. <laughs> it turns out if you zoom in on nips, they do get bigger than you think. Oh, oh no. All right. Um, Fucking... Whose nips are these? More hairy nips. Oh, God almighty. Oh, oh, oh. Is it me? Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> There's only one way to find out, Brian. Mm. All right, let's see. Uh, Terry says, rays of sunshine in the gloom, rooting for Ollie. Love you all. Uh, Lee Spicer, hello, Adam. Looking forward to taking my mind off the past 24 hours and even watching Randall Andal Datsun joining the Wrestle Talk Cue Ball Club. Uh, Donato Hunter said, all aboard the Zane train. Toot toot. Cor uh, I added the toot toot. Uh, coronavirus sucks, but Quizzlemania slaps. And someone, oh my goodness, has donated a hundred dollars saying Whoa. Randy Andy Madudson. <laughs> Randy yeah. Andy Madudson. So, well, I mean, thank you. He, he's he's I paid a hundred dollars for your opinion. In the dollar. Well, he's paid for you, Andy. So let's see who whose nips do you think these are? We're so close to 5,000 people guessing. Shawn Michaels' nips? Shawn Michaels' lorry. I've gone for Sami Zayn. but I'd... Sami Zayn. Yeah, Zayn. Wrestler. Ollie Davis. I thought I had it, and I don't. I, it's not Gunner from TNA. <laughs> <laughs> hey, yeah, I am from TNA in there. Uh, a shot in the dark, I also put Shawn Michaels. Shawn Michaels. These nips belong to... The former Blue Universal champion, it no. is Goldberg. Oh, oh, oh man, okay. I it is. wasn't even close. Wasn't it's taking a legend. Moving this to a Thursday has really thrown me off. Come on, guys, you 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 knew those were Goldberg's nips. All right, moving on from one set. Oh, we are we are over five thousand people hey. looking at these. Whose hmm. nips are these? Whose whams? Whose nips? are these he's outside uh, he oh there's a little clue for an observant fan it means nothing yeah that's and water in the background oh someone likes the beach which way to the beach <laughs> uh, angelo says you guys have just immensely brightened my day thank you love from new jersey thank you uh billy says hey there gents hope you're all well looking forward to some much needed laughs after all that's gone on and it's going on still always a lovely time with the boys hail the thing hail the thing <clears throat> All right, uh, Ollie, let's start with you this time. Hulk Hogan, brother, much love. Hulk Hogan, Laurie. Hogan. Hogan, oh, no. Randy. I I've gone for Vince, but it's probably Hogan, as everyone else is saying it. Brian. I got a uh, Hulk Hogan. Hulk oh, Hogan. No. Oh, Randy, you mad genius. However did you guess, they were, of course, Hulk Hogan. Oh. <laughs> yes! Look at them. Well oh, done, everyone. Oh, sorry. Yeah. He's I'm not throwing it. When Could it you just do a celebratory down. flush, Laurie? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> it's like marriage with children. <laughs> I mean, you are flush with points. You are now on the scoreboard, Laurie. Mm -hmm. You are taking this seriously. All right. Um, the, the final... The uh, the ultimate nips. Whose nips are these? Oh my god! <laughs> They're weird, that? aren't they? Is this picture upside down? <laughs> <laughs> hanging, hanging low it's and it's lazy. Trying to escape. They're hanging and banging. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Brian says, morning from Australia, boys. Good morning. Uh, Gutierre2NE5 says, Ollie, you need to channel Golden Joe so you can win. Joe, Joe, oh, Joe, no. Joe, Joe. I'm going to read out every Joe that there is. Joe, 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 Joe. Uh, Brian Zane is a class act, says test. Uh, delighted Thank to you. see him on, Quizzle, on Quizzlemania. Wow. Uh, and Nate S. <sighs> S says, going to sterilize that bag of hair first, right? What? And lose all the vital nutrients? Uh, so <laughs> whose nips are these, Randy? Uh, um, I can feel my hair falling out. I've gone for Vince again. <laughs> Vince again. He is fixated on Vinnie Max nipples. Laurie? Kane. Oh, he's under my hand there. Kane. Kane. <laughs> oh, this could be. Ollie. I'm, 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 it's like I only know so many nipples. I've gone for Ric Flair. Again. <laughs> Again. <laughs> end, end as you begin. And Brian? I'm going to say Vincent Mann, but I'm going to get sp sp specific and say circa 1998, <laughs> 99, when he was starting. No, those are 2000 nips. 
<laughs> uh, I can confirm they are an actual fact. 2001. No. Oh, oh, I was close. Oh, hey, yes. I'm, I'm going to give you the points anyway. Don't worry. I uh, just guessed it every time. All right. So that is the end of Whose Nips Are These? What a fantastic round. We've all learned something today. Uh, and But the important thing is who is in the lead, in last place, in fourth place, with three points. It's Laurie. Cheers to you, sir. Uh, in joint second place with nine points apiece, it's Ollie and Randy streaking away. He chose his words carefully with 15 <laughs> points. Oh. It's Brian Zane. The man knows his nipples. I am the nipple master. Let's do this. All All right. Right. My hey, right. for a ringer. <laughs> so uh, let's let's I mean, obviously, um, every everyone is feeling confident until you come up against the brick wall that is the most terrifying round no. in Quizlemania history. That's my line. In the history of what's my line, uh, I've assigned each of you a wrestler. Uh, no. You start with 20 points. You get 20 questions, uh, all of which have to be yes or no questions. For every question you ask, you lose a point, not including a correct guess. Uh, if you guess, for example, if you take three guess, if three goes and then you guess, you would get 17 points. So a whole lot of ground can be made up here. We're going to start with Andy. I start every time. Because you're so good at this game. Right. Okay. Hang on. Let me get that wrestler's information up so I'm not caught short. Should I'm going to be writing all... notes down. All it right. help. <laughs> yeah, if, if you're you. Right, have you got it? I am ready, willing, and Gable. Let's do is this. It a, is it a man? Yes. Oh, no. Good start. <laughs> right, uh, are they a current WWE star? No. Have they ever wrestled for WWE? Yes. Have they wrestled for WWE in the last 10 years? Scroll. No. Oh, no. He had to check that though, so that might be a clue. Oh no. Oh. Um. You all know this round is coming. Is he? Is he still active? No. Has he ever been a top champion, like world or universal? No. <laughs> I can't, my hair is just falling out. Um, <laughs> you might as well pull it out with the stress. Uh, I believe in you. Has he ever been a mid-card champion? Yes. United <laughs> States? No. <laughs> So I okay, so I see. <laughs> um, Who's dropping deuces on this show? <laughs> Laurie, stop pooing. Um, oh god. Come on. Uh, do they have brown hair? Yes. Oh, and he's gone. It, and he's gone. <laughs> 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 he just he just quacked. Oh, wow. yeah, he's had okay. love your bollocks. He's gone. Well, Andy, the people are rooting for you. What happened? Can't oh, lose he's coming, back. He Andy, he's coming back. Here we go. Andy, I will not stand for such tantrums on Quizlemania. <laughs> I'm tempted <laughs> to drop you a question. <laughs> um, he, had check, every, he had to check the chat. Everyone is rooting for you, Andy. Come on. You've got uh, ten uh, questions. No, wait, sorry. Did they did they have brown hair or not? <sighs> yeah. No. Yeah, no, yes. No, um, yes. No. Uh, maybe that's a good enough answer. So they were changed changed hair colour, in other words. Um that's not a question. Um You were saying you're looking it up, Andy, in the <laughs> chat. How? <laughs> or that you rage quit. <laughs> 
Um... Andy, I'm going to give you a more definitive answer to that question. Right, okay, N thank you. No, but close. They don't, they don't have brown hair, but it's close to brown. Come on, you know, infer what that means. So it's a, it's like straw, it's like my hair color. Um... No, other way. <laughs> oh, is they, they don't have hair. Um, no, never mind. What? Next question. Just Andy, him. everyone's <laughs> rooting for you. We're not past the hair, dude. <laughs> we, are okay, just, uh, we are gaining people watching. I don't understand. <laughs> so did they, wrestle, did they wrestle for WWE between uh, 2005 and 2010? Yes. Okay, that helps a tiny bit. That's such a specific guess. Um, are they Caucasian? No. Right, that helps. <laughs> Hey, whoa, hey. Uh, Slam. Uh, there's an odd, <laughs> odd temperature on that. <laughs> no, I, I mean it. That helps. Um, so, in, can, in IC champion between 2005 and 2010, who isn't Caucasian? Sheldon Benjamin. No. No, he's already he's still active. He's with them now, yeah. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> come on, put those pieces know, together, though. Andy. You got seven questions. Seven, yeah. Uh, just gotta twirl my mustache in training while you're thinking. <laughs> in the last 10 years, I see champion who hasn't got any hair who isn't. D you inferred that. Oh, wait, yeah, sorry, <laughs> sorry, yeah, that was my fault. Um. Umaga. Well done. Whoa. Well done. But, uh, why hasn't he got brown hair? He doesn't. He's got black hair. That's brown. Is it? Yeah, I'd say that's very that. dark brown. I'm a black. I'm, I'm gonna lean, I'm gonna round up to black on that one. I like. I, I I said yes originally because they're just like ah, much of a muchness. But maybe you would think, oh no, it's an actual like brunette. Rather, I wouldn't call him brunette. I'd say he has black hair. Anyway, you've got seven points. Well done. Uh, well done, Andy. You have uh, leapt into the lead. By one uh, point. <laughs> with one point. Very good. <laughs> all right. Next up on the chopping block. Oh, I bet you're all just gagging to go next. Uh, who have I put next? It is the one and only Arlie oh. Davis. Okay. You're famously good at this game. All right. Uh, so let me just get the details up. Ollie, are you ready? Yes. Then let's begin. Are they a man? Yes. Are they currently in WWE? No. Have they worked for WWE in the past? Yes. Have they ever been a top champion in WWE? No. Have they ever been a mid-card champion in WWE? Yes. Were they... Predominantly most active in the Attitude Era? No. Ruthless Aggression Era? No. You phrased the question difficultly. <laughs> do, you want to, do you want to rephrase your Attitude Era question? What, like, uh, so I guess, yeah. Were they most known for wrestling for WWE <laughs> in the Attitude Era? No. Same again for the Ruthless Aggression Era? No. Um, in the new generation era? Yes. Okay, right, good. That's eight questions. Mid-card champion. Got 12 lovely points. Just waiting for you on a correct guess. Were they ever in a prominent tag team in WWF? Yep. But didn't win the top championship. Owen Hart? No, 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 no. <laughs> that was the I, is, first one. Are you are you guessing, Ollie? Uh, I said it out loud, so count that as a guess. Good boy. He's <gasps> learned about <gasps> Owen Hart. <laughs> I was I just didn't want you. I'm so proud of you. That's eleven points, Ollie. Well done. Yes. I just wanted you to guess Owen Hart because it bummed me out last time. <laughs> right. Congratulations. Eleven points for you, Ollie. Actually, no, 12, I believe. You didn't... Oh, um, 
Yeah, 12 points. Very nice. Right, All right. Oh, still. You've soared into the lead. Right. Next up on the agenda is Brian. I'm screwed. Let's do this. Let's do this <laughs> indeed. You have 20 points to start <clears throat> with. Let me just get their information up. Uh, fantastic. I'm ready if you are. Ask your first question. All right. Is it a man? Yes. <clears throat> Is he white? No. Good questioning. Uh, does he have long hair? No. Does he have hair at all? <laughs> no. I'm gonna put it as not long hair. <laughs> um, Are you drawing like a police sketch? <laughs> yeah. Is that this actually is still a, a stick figure? Um, <laughs> are they currently <clears throat> active in WWE or AEW? No. Oh, wait, uh, hang on. Yes. Oh. Okay. Probably should have had a more narrow question. Are they currently active <laughs> in WWE? No. All right. Ooh. Is he a former world champion? World slash top yeah. tier, etc. Yes. Okay. Uh um, was he ever known for being part of a tag team? No. Uh, let's see here. I mean, he's tagged, but I wouldn't sure. say he's known for it. Sure, sure. Um, okay. Not white. Short to no hair. In AEW... Former world champion, a singles guy. God bless it. This is getting complicated. Um, does he wear? Does he wear? <laughs> does he wear traditional wrestling gear, as opposed to not jeans? Uh. <laughs> yeah. 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 He wears the tights. Okay. This is a this is a new route this of is questioning. Forensic. Brian's very good at this game. I'm just trying to I'm just trying to do some mental guess. Paint a picture. Head. Yeah, exactly. I like it. Uh, like, you I... have 11 points currently at your disposal. Okay. God Almighty. Um... Is it Michael Nakazawa? No. <laughs> Okay, I thought maybe he was a world champion for DDT or something. I don't know. I was just what, a, guess. what a slam dunk <laughs> it would have been, but no. Not, Nakazawa, got it. Just let me put that up there. You are too clever for this game, Brian. Luke got it in three last week, so he did. I'm, I'm, I'm trying. I'm trying here. Um, okay, you said he is active in AEW right now, correct? Yes. Okay. Is it Taz? Oh, it's Taz! Yeah. Oh, nice. No doubt about it, Cole! Soup bowls! <laughs> Him hocks! All right, that's <laughs> nine points for you, Brian. Very well done. That puts oh, you ahead so of Andy comfortably. All right. And finally, Laurie, it has to be you. Uh, are you ready Fortunately, for this? Fortunately, I'm taking this seriously. So You are this taking is. this super duper. I am. I, am. I have a hat. I've got serious. glasses. I'm very serious. All right, I am ready if you are ready. Hit me with those sweet cues. Okay. Have we just seen their nipples? No. <laughs> it's good to rule out. Um, have they ever come to the ring in a car? No. <laughs> no, mm. I think. Laurie doesn't want to do this next week, does he? <laughs> <laughs> uh, mm. Are they of the lady persuasion? No, no. Oh. We got there on the mean? third question. Silly men. Uh, mm. Do I like them? <laughs> yeah. 
Yeah, okay, cool. Uh, Hail Mary, it. Go for a guess Hail now. Mary. Is it Adam Cole? <laughs> no. <laughs> Someone you like that isn't Who else do I like? Is it uh, Bray Wyatt? No. <laughs> hmm. There's only so many people you can like, Laurie. You might as well just go for it. Laurie, yeah, I think I only like five people. So. Laurie, we've <laughs> lost viewers because you haven't been taking this seriously. <laughs> We're back under 6,000. Ah, How dare well. you ruin my craft? I'm playing along. I've asked good questions so far. I'm just <laughs> ruling out the ones that you might have picked for me. Um, <laughs> okay. Have they ever had... Do they have their own gimmick match? <laughs> I'd say sort of, yeah. Okay. That narrows the field, but only by a little bit. Hmm. Uh, do they have a scary persona? Yes. Mm. <laughs> How is he doing is this? Is it The Undertaker? No. Is oh. it Kane? No. Okay. Uh, who else has had a scary gimmick? You got mm. 10 points. Use them wisely. Is it the boogeyman? No. Oh, I'd put you in the lead. No, not in the lead over me. <laughs> I'm not going to be in the lead. No, I think you would have overtaken me. That was me, never though. the aim. The aim is to try and guess the person asking completely random questions, Andy. Peace um, is never an option. Let's go. So they have a spooky gimmick match. Uh, were they most active post 2000? Yeah. Laurie wants to do it now. It's changed. <laughs> it's changed. I feel like I've, I feel like I've, I feel like I've narrowed it down enough now to get yeah, it. I uh, think he's enjoying this. He's enjoying <laughs> the quiz. <laughs> they. Do they have a long entrance? I wouldn't say so. Okay. No. You have seven points. Is it Finn Balor? No. Ooh, that would have been spooky. Mm -hmm. How else is spooky? Yeah. Finn Balor's closer Finn than, Balor the, is than closer. certain guests. In, in a certain Don't way. Actually, hints. You're right. Actually, that hit, to be honest, that hint's fairly misleading anyway. So ignore <laughs> me. Ignore you. Uh, who has a gimmick match? Most active past 2000. Is it Luke Harper? No. This is my way of doing things. How many have I got left? Five points. Five, five <laughs> <two> point <laughs> questions. You got this. I wouldn't have got it by so far. Do they have a beard? No, sort of ish. I wouldn't. Uh, yes, just mm. about. So stubble. Mm. Is it Randy Orton? No. What's his gimmick match? I just feel like he was included in the Bray Wyatt Slow gimmick and boring. match. Spooky persona, though. Hmm. Can I look at the chat? No. You can count I that think, as a question. I'm, not, I'm not sure it'll help. <laughs> <laughs> Has anyone got it? Uh, I'm not looking at uh, the, com the live comments just a second, just because they are they do always get it so quickly before you go. <laughs> okay, so I have to like I have to like them. They have to have a gimmick match. Hmm. They've never come spooky. to the ring in a car. They've got a spooky got persona. <laughs> They've never Three come to the ring in a left. car. It is hard. They don't have a beard. Um, are they wearing a hat? <laughs> Not right now. <laughs> Not right now. No. Okay. Shit. Um, <laughs> fuck. Uh, what's this? One last one, is it? You've got two, two questions left. Two questions. Ah, oh, bollocks. Um... <laughs> Come on, mate. I believe in you. I don't. <laughs> you didn't ask any questions. Oh, I think I, I, think I know. I who mean, it if is, I get uh, it, I'm, I'm pleased if I get it. Uh, how have I not got this? I think I've got it. Andy thinks he's got it. Mm, they got a spooky persona. They got a gimmick match. I'm going off really random stuff. Uh, I should have narrowed down on what I thought was spooky. Um, it's too late to rescue it, Laura. <laughs> <laughs> Who do I like? Um, just, 
name two wrestlers at this point. <laughs> okay. Is it... Uh... <laughs> Just checking it's not Bray Wyatt. It's not Bray Wyatt. Not You've Bray got Wyatt, one, okay. one question left. <laughs> Just who do you think it That's is? That's the second time you've guessed. Who do I one? think it is? Oh, yeah. Well, I know that. Yeah, I was just I was double checking that it wasn't. Um, bollocks. Uh, My stream is like delayed. Is it? <sighs> oh, spooky. Got to get it on one lorry. Come oh, no. on, lorry. Name some spooky wrestlers. <laughs> can, 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 yeah, can, can we help clue? lorry out now? No, I'm not get any points. Come on, he's, he's not taking it seriously. I am yeah. taking it seriously. <laughs> All right, here's your one and only clue. One of his personas is spooky. Oh, um, yes. One of his personas is spooky. I don't know, Mick Foley. <laughs> Oh. oh, oh! It's Jeff. I was thinking Ron Hardy. I was thinking yeah. Matt. Yeah. Ah, no, no. His spooky persona was, of course, Willow. 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 Uh, so uh, scores on the doors in uh, <laughs> in last place with three points. It's <laughs> Laurie Blake. Oh. This is what taking it seriously gets you. <laughs> not worth it. Don't try. In third place with 16 points. It's not looking good for your dough, Mandy. Um, in second place with 21. It's Ollie Davis. With 24 points in first place, it's Brian Zane. It is all to play for. I would like to point out, sorry, that this is this is it's all wrong because I don't actually like Jeff Hardy. So you do like Jeff <laughs> Hardy. I, I actually I don't Throw it out. Straight on the record. I have said on multiple videos that I don't like Jeff Hardy. Me and Laurie are really? two of the only people who just don't get Jeff Hardy. And I don't consider Umar. I want to recount. <laughs> oh my god. Moving I asked, on. do I like them? You do like Fourth, him, Molly. So I want 16 points. <laughs> I would say Samoan is close to Caucasian. I'm fucking robbed. Right. <laughs> Moving on to some super chats before we carry on. Adam Sinclair has donated 10 Canadian dollars. Way back at it again with the quizzes. So glad to have you back on YouTube, Adam. This is a, such a needed distraction. Cheers from Adam and Malcolm in Edmonton, Alberta, Canada. Smiley face emoji. Buffed up chain says, first time on a live chat. I love you, Adam. You're a really funny dude. You made me love wrestling again. Don't leave again. Uh, Ed McIntyre said, bought the magazine. When's the ETA? That's a question for Ollie, <clears throat> I guess. Um, When's it going to yeah. arrive? Yeah, d depending on the worldwide delivery services, really. Uh, That's just, your excuse yeah. for everything. <laughs> uh, Asa, what the heck said? Uh, Hulk Hogan or Ultimate Warrior? The Rock <laughs> or Stone Cold? NWO or DX? Jeff Hardy or Edge? NXT or AEW? Yes to all of those. Andrew <laughs> Sachs has donated uh, $5. I hope it's the one from Faulty Towers. Oh, actually, is he dead? Uh, what is your favorite yes. pro wrestler product advertisement? Uh, his is the Mankind Ravioli advertisement. What is your favorite wrestling ad? Let's go around the table quick. Ollie, what's yours? Was it when Sting beats up a kid? The Sprite. Absolutely. Yes, yeah, one, yeah. Absolutely. Brian, what's yours? Oh, man. I have to go with Billy Jack Haynes chilling for a tanning salon in Portland, Oregon, and he's just like, <laughs> He's freaking out. I came here to get a tan. Well, Billy, they came to the right place. I know! I go all over the world, and none can compare to tan down under. My God, full of the deep cuts, Laurie. <laughs> I like uh, Seth Rollins smashing up the museum of WWE shit in uh, the 2K18 advert. Very, very good. And Randy? Uh, the South African WrestleMania 36 advert in which a <laughs> bunch of wrestlers break into someone's living room and the uh, people in the room tell them to stop fighting and start dancing. And Braun Strowman doing, like, the nene is utterly bizarre. That is a great spot. Uh, mine uh, is a similar to Mankind, a Chef Boyardee uh, advertisement, but it's the one with Kane. He's wearing a chef's hat and he does the thing and the ravioli goes everywhere and it's delightful. Uh, anyway, moving on to our next round. It's the only thing that can be actually considered a trivia round. It is Pay Per View. <laughs> Uh, back by popular demand. Uh, this one is very, very simple. Uh, so uh, I'm. There are five pay-per-views. Uh, 
and I am going to read them out one match at a time, basically, uh, from a match that would be really hard to identify the pay-per-view by to its most obvious to identify match. If you get it from the first one, that's 10 points. If you get it from the second match, that's eight points. Third match, four points. Fourth match, two points. And if you get it from the really obvious one, that's just one point. But hey, every point is necessary in this game because it is quite tight. Uh, so uh, with that being said, everyone knows the rules. Let's start with the first pay-per-view. Uh, the match is... Oh, sorry. Uh, this is a buzz-in round. Uh, your buzzers are you saying your own names. Let's all just test your buzzers super quickly. Three, two, one... Just fantastic Brian. content all right so which pay-per-view is this first match is doo -doo 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 -doo. new age outlaws versus the acolytes <sighs> new age outlaws brian, brian no. is in is it is it rumble 2000 is it rumble 2000 what a guy! Yeah. Wow. Ten <laughs> points. Oh, where oh, are my scissors? Oh, oh, wrestling oh, wrestling no Rain point. Man into this. Oh quiz. man, there's oh, a there, no. there's that nook and cranny. Look and cranny. <laughs> there we go, boys. Me, me and my brothers leave. Me and Luke. Me and Luke both said this is Brian's round, and if it comes up, everyone is screwed. <laughs> Brian, can you wait a bit? I can't cheat that quickly. Forty point. Yeah, fifty points is going to be a pretty hard to manage lead. <laughs> you're just going to have to buzz in, and because yeah, if you get it wrong, you're our eliminated from the game but you may just have to fall on these grenades lads uh, so the rest <laughs> of the matches were Chris Jericho versus China versus Hardcore Holly. Yeah. Then you had Kurt Angle versus Taz. Triple H versus Cactus Jack. You probably have got it at this point. And then Royal Rumble match. <laughs> yeah. I would have got it, it if you said 2000 Royal Rumble match. Exactly. Uh, so uh, next pay-per-view. Can you get it from this? Hardcore Holly versus Al Snow versus Billy Gunn. A hardcore match. <sighs> He said, don't do Brian. it, Brian. <laughs> Brian. Brian. What is it, Brian? Is it Mania 15? It is Mania 15. <laughs> oh, for God's sake. Oh, oh, my oh, God. God. <laughs> so long, farewell, Alvita's in your hair. <laughs> oh, oh, goodness me. All right, so the other oh, back is... Are those scissors or shears? What are you using to cut it's your hair? Kitchen, kitchen scissors. Oh, kitchen scissors? Oh, um... um you're going to scalp yourselves. Um, though it's still oh. WrestleMania 15, Ollie. These are just oh, the right. ones that you could have got. Andy. Uh, Steve Austin versus This Iraq. is what you could have won. Yeah. I could oh have won God. Sable versus Tori, yeah. In, uh, fairness, so, in fairness, one of my recurring segments is me reviewing old pay-per-views. So statistically, well, I might yes, so is Ollie and Luke. Luke. Right, yeah. Ollie and Luke has that. Being a dweeb. Yeah. <laughs> Luke and Ollie also do that for our wonderful patrons, and it's clearly that they're absorbing. It's the fine, guys. He's only twenty-three points ahead now. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! I, well, I couldn't. I could care less. I haven't got any hair. All right. Sorry, <laughs> actually, Laurie, he's uh, uh, 41 points ahead of you. <laughs> I've been right. really trying as well. <laughs> Next pay per view. Someone uh, just, you might just, Brian. Want to oh my God. Oh. <laughs> Go on, Brian. Uh, SummerSlam 2002. Well, well now. <laughs> well now. <laughs> Oh dear. Oh, oh my oh, god. Oh dear, oh dear, boys. <laughs> well, I'm just gonna hit the old dusty trail, boys. It's been a lot of fun. I'm just gonna <laughs> oh. so you had Undertaker versus Tess, Kurt Agger versus Rey Mysterio, uh Shawn Michaels versus Triple H, and Brock versus Rock. God. Last last week, everyone got really deep into these questions and didn't know them. So right. this is a real break. This week you invited a virgin. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Oh you. Oh, you. <laughs> <laughs> you, you, you. Making up for your lack of knowledge by dunking on people who do. Virgin in spirit only, folks. Well, that's, that's <laughs> All right. Final, uh, well, penultimate pay per view. Who is. Oh, that? great. Oh, that could be low. Damn you, modern shows. <laughs> oh. Uh, uh, <laughs> do we not have a buzz? Randy. Randy. Go Backlash for it. 2018. No, oh, no, no, no. You're out. You're out, I'm afraid. Oh, uh, no. Anyone else want to try their arm? I feel like this happened Ryan. a lot. Uh, Ryan? No. Let me just... I'm going to say Extreme Rules 2018. 
He's out. He's out. Right. Oh. The king is dead. The king is dead. Oh. Right. It's also played for. Brian, you're so stupid. I know. All right. I'm the worst. So this is Laurie? Eight point. Oh, wait, Laurie. You don't have to, Laurie. There no, I want to, ones. though. I'm not going to get it. That's... Okay. Laurie, why are your shoulders so massive suddenly? Because I'm also oh, I'm leaning. Oh, okay. <laughs> sure. All Laurie. right. Uh, Laurie, do you want to guess? Extreme Rules 2017. No. Uh, lo uh, so you're all out apart from Ollie. Ollie, do oh, you I'm... want to wait for the next <laughs> one? Time. Yes. Cool. Book. Ricochet versus Samoa Joe. Oh, oh thank you. Is... What show is this? Yeah, like... Must be last. Oh, nothing. Okay. Is there a buzz from you? Ricochet, Ricochet has only been up since last WrestleMania. Correct. When did Ricochet face Joe? Joe was on SmackDown. No, he wasn't. He was on Raw, but he has been injured a lot. Gonna While go Ollie is talking to himself, I'm just going to do some super chats. Jeremy Bauman <laughs> says, are you going to live stream Andy shaving his head? We have a plan for that, should the eventuality arise. But, I mean, honestly, it's anyone's <laughs> game at this point. Uh, Matt Field says, can't imagine how stressful it's for you, Ollie, as a business owner. Massive props to you. Here's to you, bro. You're my hero and the reason I watch WT. What, Quizzlemania or, or coronavirus? <laughs> Uh, Matthew Black says, just want to thank you all for keeping a smile on everyone's face. I've been looking forward to this all week. And Adam Pearson says, Datsun for the win. Mm. Yeah, thanks, mm. Adam. Mm. Pearson, right. shout out. Nice to I see love, you. I love you, Adam Pearson, but uh, I think this is going to be in vain. At some point, there will be a mathematical impossibility of me winning. Ollie, I, yeah, shall, I'm, I move, shall I move I'm going to play it safe. I, cool. I need these points. Roman Reigns versus Drew McIntyre. Oh. oh, so this... This is for four points. Roman Reigns versus, versus Drew. Well, they oh. feuded at yeah, Mania 35. So this was presumably something after then because that was Reigns' first match back. Uh, the So extreme, that was extreme rules. We, Andy said backlash. What did Andy say? Backlash twenty eighteen. Twenty eighteen. I think it's twenty nineteen. No. Backlash, backlash. twenty nine. Backlash no. twenty nineteen. No. Ollie. Ollie oh. is guessing backlash twenty nineteen. Incorrect. Kofi Kingston versus Dolph Ziggler in a cage match. Seth Rollins versus Baron <gasps> oh, Corbin. Is it Super Arabia twenty nineteen? It's no. stomping ground. Oh, of Fuck course, me. it's not Saudi because there were women on it. It's oh the, yeah! <laughs> look, it's the it's the stupid one. It's the stupid ah. show that they did. What a stupid Sh joke! Shoe show. All right. So the final pay per view. Are we all back oh, in now? One. You're all back in. Okay. Brian's on your buzzers. For <laughs> the first match is. Oh, is this oh, before I was born? <laughs> It's Dino Ollie, Bravo Ollie, versus I'm, I'm Brian Morocco. No, Ollie's no, no, going no, for it. I said Ollie. Brian. No, fine, fine, fine. You got, I, I defer to you. Ollie. <sighs> WrestleMania 3. No. Ollie's out. Brian. Brian is buzzed in. Mania 4? No. Oh, man. Laurie goes 5. Do you want to <laughs> yeah. stick with it or do you want to go to the next one? Go to the next one, please. Next Carol. one. Andy. Similar feeling. Similar feeling. Jake Roberts versus Hercules. Oh, am I still in? Yeah, we I haven't guessed yet. Yeah. Yeah. Um, no, I don't know. Anyone? <laughs> no. Three, two, one. Moving on. Demolition versus the Heart Foundation. Oh. Brian knows. Brian's, Brian's oh. itching to shout. I think, shout I, do. I, think I do. I'm already Brian, out. Do it in I'm one language. This I'm is for out. four points. You can. I can move on to you. Get it for two points. Two points is always nice. Go for it. Yeah. Cool. Well, well. Ultimate Warrior versus the Honky Tonk Man. Yeah. This is this is so not my era. I just have no. I have no Boys. idea. Uh, WrestleMania, Andy. WrestleMania eight. No. <laughs> Laurie. Take it home, like, Laurie. Go the last round. Yeah. Go on, Laurie. WrestleMania five. <laughs> Oh my God! The first ever SummerSlam. Ugh. <clears throat> cool. Oh yeah, well, I would have got that after seeing the poster. <laughs> you, I would have got that if I watched it. <laughs> Honky Tonk Man versus the Ultimate Warrior, though. That was seven years before I was born. Oh, I wish you'd never. Right. <laughs> <I don't know. laughs> 
Uh, moving on, I just want to take a quick moment from all the hilarity to plug the Wrestle Talk magazine, which is available at not wrestlemerch.com, but where, Ollie? <laughs> WrestleTalkMerch.com WrestleTalkMerch.com Grab yourself a copy and help out the magazine in these really weird times. All right, moving on to the next round. It is a brand new round. Can I quickly ask you a question, Adam? Of course you can, Randall. Uh, What are the scores and how many possible points are there left? (laughs) Uh, I'm not telling you that because that will make you sad. But I can confirm. (laughs) In last place, with three points, it's Laurie. Three just happy, just happy to be here. In third place, with I'm not 16. happy to be here again. <laughs> don't like Jeff Hardy. Not happy to be here. Stop making stuff up. In third oh. place with sixteen, it's Andy. In second place with twenty-one, it's Ollie. In first place with fifty-four, <laughs> oh my god, <laughs> it's Brian Zay. Brian, what are you doing next Wednesday evening? Apparently, I'm doing doing this. I don't know. I, I, I don't want to count my chickens or anything. But we need oh, someone. you can it's, count them. You can count Dave them. around. Is Meltzer around next week? <laughs> <laughs> All right. So the next round is brand new. Quite similar to the Nips round, which you all enjoyed. It's the weakest ink. Oh, <laughs> nice. Terrible wrestler tats. I'm nice. going to show you an cool. awful wrestling tattoo. you got to tell me who permanently etched that onto their very human mm. flesh. There are 10 points. There are three points per correct answer. So there's a potential if Brian gets none of these and one of you gets all of yeah. these, you can <laughs> close that gap. It's still... <laughs> still tension we Mathematically, still... i can't no you can't you can't <laughs> you flush yourself away where you belong but, but you andy can't. and ollie you can do this right so very quick quest uh let's start off by saying whose tat is this who's got the infected belly button we're starting off relatively uh, easy I'm cam watson working. says uh, adam i'm glad you're back in the community i'm glad i'm back too uh, jenny davis says my first ever super chat two things i love all of you mainly laurie mm. and i was wondering if there was any chance for adam p to be a guest one week well who knows maybe uh aaron iron says first time catching quizzle mania live as an essential healthcare worker i'm always on the clock when you guys start but i'm here now keep up the good work much love from new york Thank you so much for everything that you do. Uh, Dwayne the Gronk Johnson uh, says, great to have Brian, but don't let it distract you from the fact that Titus O'Neil kissed his son on the lips. Uh, <laughs> Sean Cartea says, love you guys. Glad to see Adam back on the YouTubes. <laughs> Jason Tower, 20 bucks says, love these quizzes. Seems a little something from my stimulus check. You guys are the reason my son and I watch wrestling. Thank you. You are oh, absolutely nice. welcome. Let's find out whose terrible ink is this. Brian, you know who it is. Uh, I wrote Batista. <laughs> and after a little bit of throw back i gave his little offering box when he was dick and batista very nice no extra credit Show for off. you though uh andy i feel like the undertaker <coughs> after his like eighth f5 at wrestlemania um huh. batista yeah batista uh laurie let's double those points batista batista nice. what did Ollie. you write first i have a little known affliction called tattoo blindness where I don't really care about tattoos and they all look the same. So this is going to be a low scoring round because it isn't Bobby Lashley, obviously. <laughs> what? Oh. Yeah, what? I'm not sure he's got a tattoo. Also, he's not white. I don't. <laughs> but, <Okay. laughs> Triple H Ollie, was back earlier. Ollie, I don't know how you've done it, but it's it's Batista. <laughs> <laughs> Obviously, it's Batista, the infected yeah. belly button, one of the worst tattoos in wrestling. <laughs> but hold He's your got horses. Loads more now. Who's this guy waddling into the ring, looking like a boxer matches? <laughs> Who's this fella? Is it harder? I don't know. No, nah, that's quite a famous one. It... <laughs> think, think more of the skin color, Ollie. Biggie. Now, those are some quality <laughs> nips right there. Those are some quality nips. But those are well, well placed nips. Those are good nips. Those Laurie, are do you have uh, surrounding nipple tattoos? You're a tattooed man. No, I don't have any surrounding nipple tattoos. I've got one on my leg. Oh, nice. Which you could see, obviously, if I wasn't wearing trousers. <laughs> mm-hmm. Fun fact. Charlie, Charlie Lavender says Hi again, Plumpy. Why is Laurie sitting on a toilet? I mean, I uh, don't know. 
Oh, why sorry, hang on. Laurie's got something to say. Laurie, why, why are you, you sitting on the toilet? Why would you assume it's a toilet? Mm. <laughs> it's this is just this is a normal comfort. It could be chair a flatmate in my trivatoria, triviatorium. Alpesh Patel says Brian Zane supporters give me a hell yeah. Uh Andrew Briggs says, thank you for always entertaining us. Here's my WWE network money. Be safe and best wishes to you all. Sincerely, your reigning predictions league champion, the tax evader, Andrew Briggs, CPA. Uh, Pavi let Andy out of his cage. Can we have a Quizzle Mania in teams? On one side, the Quizzle, uh, the Quizzle talk makes me shave my head of Luke, Pete and uh, L Laurie. That's a bad spelling of Laurie. Uh, versus fading hairline of Ollie, Andam and Randy. Now, my hairline is... Your hairline's um, fine, isn't it? Well, it's what you've done. Mine to it, is. Uh, mine in is certain definitely places. on its way. Oof. We're all we're all having a great old time. Right, who's uh, whose tattoo is this? Let's start with the uh, the man mm. sitting on a toilet. It is Jack Gallagher. Jack Gallagher, thank oh. you. Gallagher. Ollie Davis. Yeah, well, you know, Michael Cole. <laughs> <laughs> That would have been an amazing twist at Mania 27. <laughs> Ollie, you may still come last. Uh, Brian Zane. Gallagher. Of course. B B Batista Gallagher, actually. I didn't cross his name off. So his full name is Batista Gallagher. And Andy. Yeah, Jack Gallagher. Jack Gallagher. Uh, yep, you're absolutely right. That's monstrous. Absolutely <laughs> monstrous. Flush uh, one out for Laurie. Oh. <laughs> this is a. I wish I was on a toilet. Probably another easy one. Who's that? Eli, uh, may Andy's streak last until <laughs> Quizzlemania 30? It won't. Uh, in which he <laughs> will inevitably <laughs> lose to Charlotte Flair. Hashtag woo. Hashtag Titus O'Neil kisses. Sun on the lips. Uh, buffed up chain <laughs> says, my first live chat. Love you, Adam. Don't do YouTube again. Pray hands emoji. Uh, Dan, it's not Wrestle merch. It's Wrestle Talk merch, Adam. Also, Andy never cheated. I just put the pressure on him that there'll be no Hitchlers for the office if he's losing this one. Hooray. What? Delicious sweets. Oh, Delicious so sweet. Nice. Uh, Austin says, long time no see, Adam. WC Extra Raw live streams. Hi, Austin. Um, Raymond uh, Philip X says, uh, amazing content. Uh, Plumpy, so good to have you back. Any chance we can have a story time about your comeback? So happy you're back. Ollie, go em, boss. Go em, boss. Go em, mm. boss. All right, um, boss. Go. Why don't you go us? And t I mean, you have to know who this is. Uh, yeah. Well, yeah, I don't. So, you Cody Rhodes. All right, Cody Rhodes, Laurie. Uh, Cody Rhodes, wait. Cody Rhodes, there. Brian. Cody. Cody. And Andy. Cody. Cody. You're absolutely right. It is the, the wife botherer itself. It's his awful American nightmare neck tattoo. Whose neck tattoo, however, is this? Oh, that's oh, That's rough. Thanks. Khalid says, here's my first super chat. El Fakador okay. must do the Joe Exotic stash if he finishes the laugh. <laughs> it's canon now. Richard Cranium says, you all have nice faces. Well done. Provably incorrect. Ricky says, you're surprised Lars was not released. Strange to me. I do not like to speculate about people not being released. Uh, Buddy King says, will the Cultaholic Boys be on Quizzlemania? Who knows? Uh, start recording says, Adam, how would you describe Quizzlemania in three syllables? Brian Zane. Uh, <laughs> fun, fun, fun. Fun, fun, fun. All right. Uh, okay, whose tattoo was that? Uh, let's go with uh, our resident tattoo expert, Ollie Davis. Six, sixteen, thirteen. <laughs> I, I, I just yeah, wrote I what I saw on that one. <laughs> <laughs> ah, that famous wrestler. Uh, Laurie. I guess it's <laughs> Bailey. Bailey, interesting, Ooh. Brian Zane. I got nothing. I just kind of guessed Ruby Riot, Ruby and also Riot. through a little man putting money in the collection box. <laughs> That's nice. For the, it's very good. That's uh, hopefully that will become a full tapestry. You and don't then one need of, to suck. Like, to suck the loser, <laughs> the loser will get that tattooed on their flesh. Randy. Uh, yeah, ba I'm going on the, off the ears. I'm going Bailey. Bailey, oh. interesting. Off Someone's the ears. Uh, all right. It's got it, mildly sticky out of ears. That is, oh, all right. That's a weird thing to notice. So the story behind this tattoo, Ollie actually was smart in dictating it because it was uh, 6, 16, uh, 13, uh, because that is the date that this lady won the Divas Championship. Uh, oh. Ollie, you Terrible tattoo, that. though. Terrible tattoo, Wait, though. What date is that? 
It's the 16th <coughs> of June, I believe, 2013, which is when oh, okay. AJ Lee won her first. I forgot Americans do their dates the wrong way around. Hey, now, no we're team, no shade. Uh, so, who's awful? Now we're getting, I think now we are sort of drifting into vaguely hard territory with this one. Because, uh, you know, that one last one was bad as well. Who's that? Oh, God. oh isn't I it bad? No idea. Oh, Gosh, it's so great. Has he been shot? He's got some wounds on him. Oh, uh, yeah. All but right, it's I'll... not really incorporated into the design. No, well, unless it ha he has like a Rudolph nose. Unless he has and a, a wart on his nose. Uh, while you guys are pondering the... Also, you can what see he's it? got little bits of back hair, which gives it kind of like a weird Wolverine-style mm. mutton chop to the, yeah. the creature. Yeah, <laughs> it's like he's crying hair. I hate it so much. <laughs> uh, right, just going to do some quick super chats. Jad Reza says, I'm feeling a lorry comeback from behind victory. <laughs> well, this super chat was... <laughs> This super chat was from a while ago, to be fair. Uh, Ryan says, great work. If I send some merch in, can you sign it? Uh, when Let's let's say when, when the world gets back to normal. Uh, Riki said, uh, these are indeed horrible times from every perspective. Do you think that WWE shot themselves in the foot with the mass releases? Stay safe, guys. Uh, from, from a PR perspective, absolutely. Rocky Balboa, Laurie, please win your debut and beat the King Randy. Nope. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Laurie never wants to do this again. Innes McVeigh says, hi all, it's my brother Day's birthday today. Can you all sing happy birthday to him for his big fifth birthday? <clears throat> On three, two, one. Happy birthday to you. Stop it. Stop it. <laughs> How dare you? Uh, <laughs> Uh, we just lost right. a thousand viewers off that. I can guarantee you. <laughs> we deserve to. We deserve to. Right. Who do we think this tattoo oh, belongs man. to? We're always going to start with Ollie. I've got, <laughs> I've got, I've, I haven't got anything. You got nothing. I've got, You've got nothing. nothing. Bride Zane. Bobby Lashley. I don't know what the fuck it is. <laughs> <laughs> Interesting choice, Randy. Just, uh, I went for Kofi, but then I put Shelton Benjamin instead. Okay. And Laurie. I've just written the word Raven. <laughs> I mean, that is a wrestler. Uh, it doesn't belong to Raven. It belongs to Matt Morgan. Oh, oh what? Wow. Awful. The blue you know brain. when you're saying these are going to be hard? Yeah. I mean, you got some of them. Batista one was easy. you got to have light and shade in this Quizzlemania. Here, okay, here's an easy one for you, Andy, because you requested it. Whose is that? Um, oh, my goodness. We've, had, we've got some big pledges. Uh, Benesato says, uh, hashtag justice serve for Randy Andy Datsun. Uh, $100. He's donated $100 Whoa. to say, stop throwing it, Andy. Stop throwing <laughs> the quiz, Andy. Stop well, it. You're making the man. I have blanked on this. Uh, Patel Ron Six says, uh, oh, it's donated 105 bucks. Have to go to the store. We'll watch replay. Let's go, Datsun. It's the, it's the comeback babyface turn of the century. I got too confident. Uh, Mark Duturet says, D Duturet, I'm so sorry I'm mangling these names. I've convinced all of you guys are naked from the waist down. Good luck on the quiz, guys. It's weird that he would think that all of us are naked from the waist down. I know, down. isn't it? Laurie, how are you doing, mate? <laughs> You'd I'm be fine, able to tell if you. I was. No, absolutely fine. Can you just pan your screen down for us? Yeah, sure. So just to... Okay. Tell you what, don't you... A man who is dressed... Yeah, if you donate another hundred dollars, we'll we'll see a little bit more. Oh no, it's turned into something different. Right, uh, let's find out who. I mean, I think you all know who it is. <laughs> no, no, no. Well, Laurie, this isn't your only fans page. <laughs> Sorry, I just I finished my drink. There goes our incentive. Cheers. Thank you. Uh, right, Laurie, who do you think it is? Uh, I. Who did I write? Hang on. Wait. Oh, I just wrote, that's awful. It's like a generic creator wrestler. <laughs> I mean, fair enough. Ollie. You're not, you're not, you're not uh, wrong. Lance Storm. I, I Lance don't know. Storm. Uh, I'm going to, Randy. Is it Mr. Kennedy? Mr. Kennedy. Brian. I have Mr. Kennedy. <laughs> <laughs> Kennedy. <Yes. laughs> um, Fantastic. I'm glad you're coming back next week. All right. <laughs> Whose is... Oh, it was Mr. Kennedy. There he is. You can see the outline of it on his shoulder. It's dreadful. Whose is this? Popeye? 
I am, I that, am I. that I am. That looks more like I am they, <laughs> they jam. I am <laughs> that, that says, I am. That says jam that jam. <laughs> it looks <laughs> like. Jam that jam. <laughs> <laughs> that jam. Jam, that jam. That jam, that jam. Oh, is that all you do? <laughs> God, if only I mean, we could see a nipple on this one. I uh, I thought it I thought like the little thing after the, the that was a comma, so it's like I am that, I am. But no, uh, jam that jam is infinitely better. Uh Dean Stonebridge says Carol Baskin killed her husband. Hey, are you cool, Captain Quinn? Uh, simple that crisis says bitch. bro 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 also go tony the milkman uh angry buffalo fan reminded that brock lesnar kissed kurt angle on the lips he sure <laughs> did um ethan carter joe 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 uh chris shavio shut ship shavio please get city british wrestling t-shirt up at wrestletalkmerch.com please well maybe coming soon all right so enough of that ollie who do you think it is? Uh, Jammy McJam fake jam jam. <laughs> <laughs> ah yes, the old rule of improv. Jam is always funny. Laurie, I've not written anything. I'm just going to say who thinks I am that I am. Uh, Baron Corbin. Baron Corbin. Who is is Baron Corbin that basic? Randy, I definitely recognise it, but uh, Linda McMahon. <laughs> <laughs> Those are quality forearms for Linda and Brian. I was gonna guess uh, Hogan because he's been going through some stuff in his older years, getting tattoos for no reason. So I'm gonna guess the Hogan tattoo. Un, un, unstoppable. It's Hulk Hogan. No. <laughs> oh my god! He's cheating. He's looking it. it up on Wikipedia. Hell, I am. <laughs> he is that. He is. <laughs> I'm all about that jam, brother. Linda got right. that one as well, but it's not on her arm. All right, come on. Who is this awful fan of tribes? Who's that? Oh. Mark Egan says, rooting for you, Ollie. You can break the streak. <laughs> also, can't wait for future AEW tag team champs, MJF EC3. Uh, that's a fantastic pairing, to be fair. Uh, Gavin Amy says, yo, all, and keep up with the grat work. Also, take care and keep safe. And question for Brian. Uh, when are you going to do a New Japan Pro Wrestling Classic pay-per-view review? Oh, Jesus. That's, uh... woo, no one's requested it, I don't think. Um... If I get one, I might. I'll have to like talk to some people who know more about New Japan than I do because I, I barely get the facts right half the time on my own stuff at WWF. Hmm. So I'd like to be able to <laughs> know what I'm talking about with New Japan. Uh, yeah, Ethan yeah. Carter says, Joe, Joe, Joe. Sorry, Andy. Uh, but there, I, we, we've got quite a few. And, and also, thank you so much to everyone who's donated. That is absolutely wonderful. Uh, we really, really appreciate it. Um, uh, Danger One says, I once sent Andy a keychain because I was bored. Datsun 316 Wait, said, I, I just read it. the chat. Get the keychain, Andy. Trenton Brown says, to see Adam Blompy and Brian Zane together in a video again puts a smile on my face. Thanks for the entertainment you guys are putting you. in these time. Good seeing you. Hi, 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 high five. Hi, 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 hi. High five, high five. I was like smacking eye right now. <laughs> yeah. Uh, David Dickers says, greeting from the Netherlands. I have viewed the previous ones multiple times and this one as well. No regrets, but with a W because of, because of, it's on brand. Uh, Alan Monson yeah. says, uh, $9.99. Quizlemania is running wild. Nothing better than having a lovely time with the boys. Thank you for entertaining us and stay safe, my friends. Dustin Y, $20. Cheers to the boys from across the pond. Manny Perfecto, $20. Thanks for your entertainment during these tough times. Let's go, Ollie. <laughs> it's just like spitting in the sea at this point. Uh, Rahul Hansraj says, welcome back, Adam Blompier, the Taylor Swift of YouTube wrestling channels. I thank, thank you. Th let's go with thank you. Hey. Uh, and, and the keychain, the keychain. It's on my keys. There you go. That's absolutely wonderful. Thank you, Danger One. All right. Whose tats are these? They are absolutely woeful. Uh, let's start with Brian this time. I'm going to guess uh, Randy Orton before he got the sleeves. I'm just. Ah, uh, oh, that was what I thought. But I'm not sure, though. Uh, Randy? Uh, Nicholas. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, success went to his head. Ollie? Jam again. Oh, the, the, the jam. The, the jam says. And uh, Laurie. Uh, one of the guys from Twilight. Hashtag Team Jacob. <laughs> hashtag Team Jacob. Well, shit Jacob. in a handbag. It's Randy. Oh. Oh. Look how bad they are. Oh, I thought that before. God almighty, he's white. All right. Whose dreadful tattoo is not that? This. 
Oh, oh. that. Let's, let's, let's end with some classics. Eternal Blue, that was very inconspicuously done, Andrew. Brilliant little chat check. Ethan Carter says, Joe, Joe, Joe. Damien Stewart, the boys are back. Adam, would you reconsider? Would you consider rebooking Rusev Day? Absolutely. Uh, one of the biggest myths <laughs> of uh, modern booking opportunities. Uh, Ryan Mahorny says, key NHS worker here, just home from work. Thank you so, so much. Yeah. Uh, knowing this was happening tonight has got me through the day. I'm on the hashtag Zane train, but rooting for Ollie, uh, rainbow emoji. Uh, and Jeremy says, watching this while two toddlers scream and destroy my house and my wife contemplates divorce. Keep up the good work. <laughs> the rest of you get an attaboy for trying. Marvellous. All right. Whose tat is this? Uh, Brian, you seem to know, so I'm going to go to you last. Let's go to Ollie. I think I've got it. Is it Scott Steiner? Scott Steiner. Interesting. Laurie? Joe Exotic's sixth husband. <laughs> <laughs> Randy? Uh, Scott Steiner. Scott Steiner and Brian Zane. You know, they say all men are created equal. When you look at me and you look at Ollie Davis, that statement is just not true. Scott Steiner. Oh, of course it is. Look at it. Look at it. Oh, it's absolutely gruesome. Uh, speaking Works of gruesome, for him, for him, whose is that? Oof. That is. Uh, a tattoo seen only in nightmares, but who oh, does it belong to? That's quite a new one. Is it one of those depth perception ones where if I move, well, like a it magic would, eye, it would look different? Yeah. No, it's not. Maybe it is. I don't know. Let's say no for now. Is this a famous one? Is it considered famous? Mm, no hints. Um, Malik says, enjoying the channel. Keep up the great work, guys. Uh, LPD Ninja, let's go Z Man. Damn it, Blake, you are the IRL S word poster. Uh, my wife won't let me buy a title belt, so please take my money and make one for Quizzle Mania. That's not a bad idea. Uh, Jet and Deep Singh says, great job, guys. I watched the other two quizzes today and now watching this live from India. Great going, guys. It's 2 a.m. here. Thank you for staying up, you legend. Uh, and finally, um, Taz, best friend on Twitter of Brian Zane, says Frisco Flame. All right, <laughs> yeah. whose tattoo? <laughs> whose tattoo do we think this is? Ollie, come on. Rock. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. The Rock. The it's Rock. It's not The Rock. All right. And Laurie, who do you think it is? Kevin Owens. Kevin Owens. He does have a bull on his arm. Randy. See, I thought Kevin Owens. I, think he might have, I thought he might have had a cover up. Kevin Owens. But I don't and... think it's a bad tattoo. Brian Zane. The rock. To rock. Congratulations to the elder statesman of Quizzlemania. It's the rock. Yes. How did look yes! like that? He covered up the Brahma bull tattoo with this. Oh. With this. How? I mean, I Terrible. I know it's I know it's like it's technically fine, but one of the most iconic tattoos in no, all of wrestling better. history. Oh, Andy, come on. Come hey, on, I'm Andrew. A, I'm a, a like, coiner, sir. How do you hide that tattoo in that other tattoo? Where in that other tattoo? Is that <laughs> tattoo the, Brahma, the Brahma ball is quite a small tat, remember? Well, I guess his arms are. And his arms got bigger. So if anything, the tat got smaller. True. Uh, yeah. uh, right. So um, we'll do that for you. Those are the final, the final tats. Uh, in last place with 12 points is Laurie. Love in third place with 31 is Andy in second place with 33? It's Ollie. That's a in, win. In Way first place out. with 78. <laughs> <laughs> it's Brian. I'm going to so, have to come up with all new rounds for Brian. Adam, is it all to play for? <laughs> Just no. like Google was created for a reason. <laughs> I wish right. I were playing for something. I wish there were some stakes. Come on. <laughs> Brian, if you win, you have to cut your hair off. Yeah. There are stakes for some of us. Don't worry about that. Right. A returning favorite now. It's <laughs> the Artist Collective. Uh, I love yeah. that picture. <laughs> All right. So I'm going to put you guys into pairs. Um, Ollie, you are one and Sorry. four on the <laughs> dice. <laughs> Randy, oh. you are two and five on the dice, and Laurie, you are three and six on the dice. Brian, your partner is Andy. Oh, Finally, man. the I weight around draw. your neck, the weight around your neck that you sorely need. Uh, okay, so the way this is going to work is I am going to give one of the pair, it's, it's Pictionary, I'm going to give one of the pair a famous wrestling moment. They have 30 seconds to draw 
that wrestling moment. And then the other person must guess it. If they do, they both get five points. It's loads of points. Uh, however, if uh, they don't get it right on the first guess, both people get nothing. Each person gets chances to draw two different things. Eight questions, five points for each question. All right. So we're going to start with uh, team uh, 1A. So Ollie, this is for you to give to Laurie. Laurie, please close your eyes. All right. Ollie, this is for you to draw. All right, your 30 seconds starts now. Now to read some Super Chats. Frisco Flame, $2. What an incredibly diverse panel. <laughs> uh, screw you too, buddy. Uh, Scared Orange uh, says, thanks for the essential service, guys. Welcome back to YouTube, Adam. Brian, did you run BZW E-Federation in 2001? If so, I was in it as Kid Lightning. Yes, BZW was my E-Fed, and I was such an egomaniac, I named it after myself. Amazing. Uh, <laughs> Flying Master was going to ask a question about WWE, but not talking about them at the moment. Have the money anyway. Stop drawing, Oliver. All right, yep. let's see. What did you draw? Unveil your masterpiece. Laurie, what is this? <laughs> <laughs> a tables, ladders, and chairs match. Oh, hang on. That is incorrect. Because it was, of course, TLC2 oh, was okay. the correct um, answer. I understand why you did it, Ollie. Mm -hmm. There were two of each, but unfortunately, there are nil pois for that team. Uh, so uh, we're moving on to the other team of Brian and Andy. Brian, you're going to be drawing this one. Oh, Andy, no, please you close your eyes. Oh, my God. Someone's sick. All right. All right. I'm not looking. Okay, tell me when. All right, go. And moving on to some super chats. Uh, Pavi let Andy out of his cage. Ollie had to pay uh, Laurie so Ollie doesn't come last again. Uh, Ryan, NHS worker here, knowing this was happening, has got me through my shift. Thank you very so, 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 so much. Uh, I'm on the Zane train, but hoping for an underdog Ollie win. Uh, at this point, I want Quizzlemania to bring uh, Laurie every time just to see what random places he uh, can do the quiz from. Mm -hmm. Kid Campbell, Brian is going to need another title belt. And Vincent says, love you guys today. I learned I know Finn Balor's nipples very well. Stop drawing, please, Brian. Okay. All right, Brian. Reveal your masterpiece. What is that? Andy, what is that? What? <laughs> Am I being really stupid? Yes. Andy, what is that? <laughs> um, <laughs> sorry, Brian. I'm really bad at everything. So am I. I'm bad at drawing. Uh, turns out. <laughs> no, well, clearly everyone else knows what that is. Because yeah, um, we all told the what. Oh, D DX invading the car park thing. I'll give you that. Yeah. I'll give <laughs> you that. Whoa, well Eyes done. sidling over to the live chat. It's a it's a sound strategy. <laughs> five points for Brian. Five points for. Andy, Laurie, it's your turn to draw something. Oh, I will literally for... share my screen. Oh, oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, right. Uh, everyone close your eyes. Uh, so, not everyone. Uh, literally, Ollie, close your eyes. Laurie, look at this. All right. Starting in now. Uh, Lucas says, uh, let's go, Zane. Brazil is rooting for you. That's a oh, big wow. cut. The fifth biggest oh, country Brazil. in the world. Yeah, That's amazing. Yeah. That is that's like a, that's six, that's hundreds of millions of people. That's a lot of soccer balls. Yeah. yeah. Uh, hi, guys. Keep up the great work. Your content got me the first three weeks of lockdown. I'm sure it'll keep me sane for the next three weeks. Uh, new series for Brian Zane. Who reviewed it better? Wrestling with Regret versus Wrestle Talk. Uh, good hey. morning from Melbourne, Australia. Thanks for the awesome start to the day. P.S. Brian Zane is a legend. Zane Mania running wild, hitting 500 F5s all over you. Stop drawing, Laurie. Laurie, stop drawing. Laurie, stop drawing. It's not right. going to help him. <laughs> uh. <laughs> <laughs> well, is he, is he saying rules? Rules. <laughs> I had to. I had to. I had to. Uh, he's actually saying balls. Don't balls. You, you're not allowed to write things, but go for it. I, Let, mean, I mean, I don't think, and I don't think Ollie's going to get it from this. Well, I, 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 the only drive. thing with a gun. Oh, um, is it when Stone Cold did the fake gun on Vince McMahon? That raw. Oh, angle? when you said Stone Cold, I thought you had it. Oh, I was going <laughs> to say Pillman. Oh. Is, that, is that Kevin Kelly saying balls in the drawing? Is that, that looks like Kevin Kelly's hair from back then. <laughs> oh, God, they Obviously, all had terrible hair. Very artistic, I think. 
Sorry, Brian, man. there is a chance I won't know what the thing is that's being drawn, so I might just have okay. to draw what I think. All right. So, uh, Brian, please hard. close your eyes as I reveal this to Randy. <laughs> <laughs> All right, your time starts now. Andy, oh, you my, can open your eyes, Brian. My pen's not working. Uh, hi, guys. Please help me apologize to my fiance, uh, Che Charman. Carmen? Uh, I worked overtime and missed her calls. I don't want to be in a doghouse while uh, we are away. Uh, he's very sorry, Carmen. Please, please forgive him. Don't can't you text her? Yeah, actually, you know what? Yeah, <laughs> is she oh, watching? Fuck him. Why You're is right, she Carmen. watching Quizlemania? <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, Fabe says great stuff, guys. Fans of you all. Uh, Philip Hansen says love you, Laurie. You Southeast London legend. Hashtag Kelsey Park. Stop drawing, Randall. Hashtag Kelsey Park. Uh, right, sorry, Brian. All right. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> what is he wearing? <laughs> 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 what the fuck is that? <laughs> is that like a zoom in on like his his uh, mitochondria we're seeing there? <laughs> no. Uh, okay. I'm just gonna guess and say Taker and Kane fighting on the corpses of their dead parents. <laughs> no. Oh. Big boss man, that's a police badge. Okay. What? No, it isn't. That's is a it? heart. That's a yes. human heart. It's an aerial view of a fried breakfast. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I can't draw. Oh, you really can't. Oh you can God. you can really draw dragon fruit though. Thank you very much. Right. All right. You've each had a go. I trust all of you will do better next time. Laurie, close your eyes while I give Ollie something to draw. Ollie. Draw this. All right, your time starts now. Uh, Justin Edelheit says, Extreme Rules 2019, I want in on Quizzlemania. Uh, the best AME says, Rooting for Zane all the way. Well, that's, yep, well well placed. Hi, <laughs> hey, everyone. Been a while since I've been in a place to super chat. Love this show, by the way. My my question, true or false, Evan Calder is a true wrestler? Oh, for the for the roster or imposter. Uh, Connor Richardson says, what was everyone's reaction to that edge shoot at Mania? That really made me uncomfortable and quiet quiet for a while and stop drawing please ollie oh, oh that's okay. a good sound <laughs> <laughs> oh what <laughs> what wow I, 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 I know what it is there's someone going through the barbershop window but i can't remember who it is that goes through the barbershop window oh go on is there a problem with but no, that's not going to help me. I can't, I can't <laughs> you know remember what? anything. <laughs> I'm going to get. I'm going to the barbershop window. It's a moment. I'm going to give it to you. Christ, ah. you need it. Right there, you go. Five and five for Ollie and Laurie. Well done. Okay, uh, who's next? Brian, I believe this is for you. Okay. Um, close your eyes, Andy. Brian, I want to see that drawing skill. Recreate this. Okay. All right, time starts now. Hollywood Dash, uh, Cultaholic collab for the future? It's always possible. Angry Buffalo man, uh, fan says, all of you all help me get back into wrestling. Don't forget the Brock Lesnar kiss Kurt angle on the lips. Matt Field, <laughs> last week, Larson, it's time for Steve. Hashtag going and raw. <laughs> uh, Josh Park says, Adam, please fantasy book the teased new evolution featuring Triple H and Kevin Owens. Um, the Mighty Mighty Corn, really glad to be able to catch the show live. I look forward to Brian, the Nipple Master Zane merch, uh, and Ollie for the hot tag. Uh, stop drawing, please, Brian. All right, let's see that masterpiece up close. What? <laughs> <laughs> I like that. Oh, oh, the fiend being John Cena at WrestleMania 36 it, in in the Fire Fly Funhouse match. Yeah, very <laughs> nice. Yes. Well, I got it. From from I got that. No, what got, what got me that? It was the armband. It was the arm. It was the yeah. armband. <laughs> and, the and those horrible shorts. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Good Laurie, story. this is for you. <sighs> Um, oh god uh, Ollie close your eyes Laurie here we go oh no for 
<laughs> your time starts and now sylvester 19 says ollie for the hot tag uh buddy king blompier have a cam patchu on me as you were an audacious ferret ciao and bella cam patchiao see ya absolutely yep. loser gets whose nips are these tattooed across their chest flame ink rumor cody wants zach ride in aw thoughts Maybe, hopefully. I mean, started late, so I'm going to start over, says Buckshot1996. But thanks for all the laughs, and thanks, Brain. Not Brian. Brain got me, uh, introducing me to the world of wrestling YouTube, and also all hail, mighty Maccabee. Stop drawing, Laurie. Hey, Stop drawing, please. You're not going to get this, funnily enough. You might. You're not. <laughs> Ooh, what? Someone... <laughs> oh, I get it. Who won it's... the butt championship? <laughs> the, the butt dick champion. The butt, the butt dicks. <laughs> <laughs> They're standing the on some form of well. podium. It looks like an old person with a walking stick has fallen backwards. <laughs> um, <laughs> I, I have... Is that meant to be a cage? Is that a steel cage? Is it a triple? Oh, it's it's the, the it's is it the triple cage match from WCW? No, but I'm amazed you got that. It's David Arquette becomes oh. world champion. But I mean, like that's amazing. You know, well done on recognizing I mean, well that. Well done on getting narrowing down the people. I went for mm. something that we'd both seen quite recently. Well, it was from that film, yeah, yeah. And finally, that film. Randy. Yeah, Brian, please close your eyes. Sorry, Brian. This is for you, Randy. <laughs> all right your time starts now you can look now brian uh brandon mascuso said great content stay healthy you too david nicholson uh hello i don't have anything to say but you guys are just great you're great too thank you for more great content during this tough timelines much love from swaf under a lovely hashtag a lovely time with the boys hashtag thumbs up party uh, love you guys. Super happy Adam is back, said K2KYD. Uh, Skullduggery Unpleasant said, Hi, Adam. Great to have you back. Generally got me back into wrestling when you started back up. Culture. Fantastic. Uh, and Ryan, uh, stop drawing, please. Uh, Randy. Uh, awesome. All right. Let's let's <sighs> let's see. Let's see how this goes. Hmm. Uh, hmm. Is it Vincent Mann versus God? Very good. <laughs> <Whoa. laughs> I, I originally had verses, but then I didn't realize where I could put that, so I crossed it out. Very, very good. Well done, everybody. That is a fine round of the Artist Collective. You've all done really well. Uh, the scores on the doors in last place with 17 points. Uh, it's Laurie. In third place with 38 points, it's Ollie Davis. In second place with 46, it's Ali's... Andy Datsun. What? In first place. That was sudden. Uh, you, got, you got a lot of those right. Uh, really got in, carried by Brian there. Yeah, he did. Oh yeah, got, of course. I was one. I, I realized. Yeah, I forgot we got point, point, both pot got points. Uh, and in in first place with ninety three <laughs> points, it's Brian saying. Go, go for the triple. Go for yeah, the, can you can you break the triple digits? Three digits. What's All the right. highest? What's the, what's the highest uh, score on this game so far? Probably who's, the who's, first week because we did like like, eight, like next it, rounds. Yeah, like even then, I think it was like sixty or something. <laughs> All right. Like, so you, yeah, well done, mate. Uh, um, survival the of the people who know the most about a very specific wrestling category. It is our final round, and as always, we go to the survival round. Um, in this, you, uh, you, it's, it's a survival. Uh, you try and list things of a certain category. When it comes to you, your it's your turn. Uh, if you manage to list a thing in that category. Uh, you stay in. If you don't, you are eliminated from the game. Uh, whoever is less standing gets 10 points. Then it goes down to uh, uh, six points, then two points. And if you're eliminated first, you get zero points. Uh, examples of past games are WrestleMania main events, reverse chronological. Everyone's just listing in the right order until mm. they are eventually eliminated. And there can be, in true Highlander style, only one let me just get this list ready to go all right so this is going to be there are going to be three of these the first one is money in the bank winners Ooh. reverse <sighs> chronological we're going to go uh women then men uh for the years that they were both and then obviously when it's just men then it's just men uh let me 
just get the list up. Here we go. Here we go. All right. So the starting order is going to be uh, Laurie. We're going to do it in order of uh, points. So we're going to go Laurie, then Ollie, then Randy, Damn. then Brian. Oh, fuck. Uh, yeah, so All was... right. So to, uh, to be clear, <laughs> to be clear, we're starting with Money in the Bank 2019. And I need the women's. Yes. From you, please, Laurie. Bailey. Correct. He's still in. Ollie. Brock. Correct. He's still in. Randy. The women's from 2018, please. Cock. It was not cock. <laughs> um, uh, Bailey, who cashed in? Alexa. Bliss. Correct. Um, Brian, the men's from Money in the Bank 2018, please. <clears throat> Damn it. Uh... Yeah, so Lesnar was last year. What was the year before? Shit. Um... <sighs> Corbin? The king is yes. dead. Oh. All right. Oh. Zero points for Brian there. Uh, so we move on to the next in line, which is Laurie. Mm. Braun? It was indeed Mr. Monster in the Bank. Uh, now we're moving on to uh, Money in the Bank 2017. The women's, please. Ollie. Uh, so I believe this was the first women's Money in the Bank match, although... Uh, it didn't that like if we're going reverse chronological, that means there was a Money in the Bank ladder match after that, so technically next on SmackDown. Oh, interesting. Okay, we'll do that. Absolutely. Which Carmella won? Correct. Uh, in which case, uh, Randy. Well, um, she she the, won the other one as well. Technically, unless you count James Ellsworth. I count Carmella as winning that one. Yeah. So absolutely. So who won the men's in 2017? Please, Laurie. Uh, Baron Corbin. Correct, Amundo. All right, we are down to uh, we are well. We have th a, a run of three, one per shows. Uh, so, Money in the Bank 2016, please, Ollie. Oh, God, it is so tough when you're in the hot seat. I, if it helps, Ollie, I don't know. If you go out at the same time, you get the same number of points. If you 2016. Go First year of the brand split. It would have been before the brand split, though. Um, or were there two lad two lad matches? It wasn't. Oh, I, I can't remember who cashed in. Ah, uh, Mr. Money in the Bank. 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 Waiting for it to kill the, the next Ooh, line to come out. Mr. Money in the Bank. Ooh, Mr. Who Money had in the, bank. the briefcase for ages? Kevin Owens? All right. <laughs> I think it was Dean Ambrose. Correct. Laurie. Is this 2015? 2015. Seth Rollins. Question mark. All right. Randy. If you get this right, you get the full 10 points. Otherwise, you split six. Uh, you and Laurie both get six. I was already talking, otherwise it's not very entertaining. Uh, Dean Ambrose won it that year. Who carried it? Who did it cash in? You got this, mate. Do it for your hair. You can't save your hair at this point. But do it <laughs> I can't hair. save my hair. Uh, picked it up. Come on, mate. Who won? Come on, mate. Mate. Is it obvious? Mate. Come on, mate. Uh, sorry, chat. I don't know who this is. Um, who won Money in the Bank? Was it so 2014? 2015. 
Only 15. Going to have to push you for an answer in five, four, three, two, one. <laughs> Bray Wyatt. I know, I know it was Bray Wyatt. Bray Wyatt. It was no. Seamus. Oh, all right. So oh. you and Laurie each get six points. Uh, Ollie, you get two. Brian, I'm afraid you leave with nothing. Brian's an idiot. I don't know nothing oh. about wrestling. <laughs> all right. So this one is going to be a bit harder. Oh. Uh, <laughs> reverse chronological order. United States champions. Oh, okay. Who's the current? <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know the current you, one. Is. You know who the current one is, Randy. Do you actually not know who the current one is? I know uh, who the current one is. I've... Oh, yes, 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 I do. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. <laughs> You're so happy. Can I, can I start? <laughs> no, you can't start. It goes in order of who's in what order. Uh, so let the, the current scores are 23 to Laurie, uh, 40 to Ollie, 52 to Andy, 93 for Brian. So we're going to go in the same order. So uh, Laurie, please start us off. Andrade. Correct. Uh, Ollie. Who does Andrade win it off? <laughs> Oh my god! So my notes, because I thought oh, I'll start trying to write down some notes. I've got Andrade, and then I've just got AJ and Kevin Owens because I know they, <laughs> they just they, they did just it for ages. Bloody hell, they did! Oh wait a second! No, Andrade wait. didn't beat Ricochet. Cool. Off he that. goes. Damn it! That was my answer. <laughs> Randall. Uh, Who won it? Did he? Oh, did he win it at Christmas? Is it Rey Mysterio? It was Rey Mysterio. Very good job. All right, Brian. Uh, Samoa Joe. Incorrect. Um, <laughs> We've got two. AJ. Absolutely bang on the banana. So uh, Ollie has zero. Brian has two points. And you boys are still in the game. So, who do you think it is, Andy? Oh, who, who's... Sorry, who, what have we had so far? We've had Andrade. Andrade. Rey Mysterio, Rey Mysterio. And the gay community, AJ Styles. Oh, I wouldn't have gone. Uh... <laughs> Ricochet. Correct. Very good. Uh, Laurie. AJ? Incorrect. See, this Randy. is what the thing is. This is why people think I'm cheating because it just happens this way. <sighs> Who did Ricochet run it from? Joe. No, but did he just say Joe? No. Oh, Congratulations, Joe. Andy. Oh. Ten points are yours. He did indeed win it from Samoa Joe, who won it from Rey Mysterio, who won it from Samoa Joe, who won it from Our truth Shiki Nakamura, Russo Shiki Nakamura. Well done, everyone. Back you come. All right. So the final question. Oh, of... can, can I can I ask for standings? Where's Laurie at? <laughs> <laughs> Why would you care? Hang on, let me just doesn't want to be last. <laughs> uh Laurie currently has 29 points. Okay. Uh, so I'm afraid it what? looks like your streak is... It looks like, in fact, we are going to break both streaks at Quizzlemania oh. 3. You have to shave your head, Ollie. Uh, Laurie, uh, 29. Ollie, 40. Andy, 62. Brian, 95. You are so close to breaking that 100. All right. So this final category of Quizzlemania mm -hmm. 3 is quite simply SummerSlam. Main events. Reverse chronological order. <laughs> I'm gone in the first round. I can't remember what the fuck the... Oh, <laughs> you guys have got this. All right. Is everyone ready to begin? No. Uh, I think the standings are still the same. So we are going to go uh, Laurie, then uh, Ollie, then Andy, then Brian. So Laurie, the main event of last year's SummerSlam it's the most recent one, year. the one that well, just I happened. I'm aware, uh, and I don't pay attention to that sort of thing. Um... <sighs> it 
Can I just say a quick thank you to the six thousand, six and a half thousand oh, people yeah. watching us right now, and to everyone who has sent in a super chat. We appreciate you more than we can say. Um, uh, I, I, some people are worried that their super chats won't be read out after the quiz. I'm going to stick around and read out all of the super chats. I was literally um, on the Wikipedia page for this today, and I only read the bit about Bray Wyatt. I'm on it right now, so. Uh, <laughs> balls. Uh, what happened at SummerSlam? What was the main? <coughs> oh, uh, Brock Lesnar, Seth Rollins. Bang on the banana. There it is. 2018, please, Ollie. I'll give you a clue. It took place in the Barclays Center. Brock Lesnar. <laughs> First is. Samojo versus Braun Strowman versus Roman Reigns. Cool. Uh, <laughs> he was so Andy. ridiculous. Uh, I uh, probably okay. Well, everyone's going for Brock. So Brock versus Roman. Correct, Brian. Uh, that one is Brock, Joe, Braun, and Roman. Correct. All right. Uh, Twenty seventeen, please. Laurie. Oh, for God's sake. Uh, my memory doesn't work like this. Sorry, no. Um, 2016, please, Laurie. 2016? Oh, now he knows it. Oh, good. Yeah, goodness. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm up on that. Uh, Is this the longest you've ever spent on the toilet? Probably, yeah. My, do you know what? My foot's gone dead multiple times throughout <laughs> this thing. It's like it's actually really weird if you don't have the bum support, because I have got the seat up. Laurie, do what I imagine. do. Um, yeah, it's, 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 leg. my left my left foot's gotten completely dead multiple times. Um, I'm gonna have to, 2016. It was Brock Lesnar Roman Reigns the year before. Well, no, no, it's the the multiple man one. I don't care. <laughs> That's not an acceptable answer. Brock Lesnar Roman Reigns. Afraid not. It Off he pops. Uh, two points to Laurie. Um, Andy. Uh, Brock Goldberg. Come on, Brian. Take it out in style. 2016, was that Brock Orton? It was indeed Brock Orton. 10 points to you, Brian, which takes you over 100. And, well, that's the way it That was when he went. busted his head open, wasn't it? It's yep. when he elbowed him yeah. to death. Yeah. That's correct. Oh, uh, yeah. So the final scores are in. Thank you so much for joining us for Quizlemania 3. Thank you to Laurie, who ended the game on 31. Uh, Ollie, your streak is broken. Do you have anything to say about not coming in last this time? Well, Laurie actively wasn't trying. <laughs> and he still came pretty close in the end. You're right. You're right. So I would I would like to disqualify Laurie for not uh, <laughs> taking part in the quiz in officially sanctioned quiz environment. So, Ollie, I'm afraid you did come last this time. That's um, fair. I think that's fair. Randy, you have come second on a, a respectable 64 points. You know what? Which I any, other, yeah. any other quiz I don't feel too bad about that. Any like, other quiz like Mania, you'd have walked that with have it. Won. Uh, yeah, Brian, triple um, digit. He's triple digits. I don't know what Ro to say. I, I'm, I, sorry to my parents, <laughs> and my mum said no when I told her what I was going, to, what I might be having to do. Um, and yeah, so I just, on, I, I hope this, this kills the rumours. <laughs> on any, on any other day. You would have um, probably won it, but I'm afraid. The room is that because I am looking at the center of the screen, therefore, that must be cheating. Uh, Peeling back the curtain, that's where everyone is on my screen. I'm just going to... Uh, no, it's not. They're, they're up here. <laughs> right, hang on a second. I'm just going to remove Ollie and Laurie so that we can have an official handing over ceremony of the Quizzle Mania Championship. Uh Andy, is there anything you want to it's say? It's a catch up. Is there it's anything not, you want we can to we can pretend it is? Have you wait? What have you got in that room that we could? Have, have I got anything? We've got the same thing in the same room. Stay that? Stay for No, have you got anything else? <laughs> I'm in an office. I don't have a. Catch have you got a mobile? Really have you got your mobile exists. phone? Have yeah. You got your cell phone. Yeah, I got my phone. Yeah. Okay, cool. Let's do There's that. There's like three phones in here for some reason. <laughs> Let's do that. All right, Andy. Uh, I take. I leave it to you as the uh, once and former. 
Quizomania champion, a man who has lost his hair in the pursuit of quiz. What would you like to say handing over your trophy? Um, are we going to say what, what what the plan is? The plan is, oh, well, I mean, we'll, we'll say what the plan is. We'll okay. say what the plan is after the ceremony. Please, Andy, cool. some ceremony, if you Brian, want. Brian, that was utterly humiliating. You, the one round that actually needed trivia, you proved that it was important. Um, <laughs> I'm proud to have won the first two weeks. Um, I will now close all my Wikipedia tabs because they were clearly useless. <laughs> um, and I, yes, thank you so much for coming on. And I look forward to seeing you beat everyone for weeks to come. Here you go. Oh, well, thank you. Thank oh, you very much. You go. Oh, it's such an honor oh. to have this uh, this award, to be the new champion. Um, I went into this not really expecting that I was going to uh, do as well as I did. Uh, but it's it's really cool, really fun to, to flex my, cre my, my trivia muscle uh, among some quality opponents. This has been a lot of fun, and I look forward to defending this championship every three or four months like Brock Lesnar does. So. <laughs> All right. So this is these have been our players. Thank you so much for joining us. Uh, I am going to stick around to read every last Super Chat because uh, we appreciate you for joining donating your money so much that's amazing uh i'm gonna say uh my goodbyes right now to brian brian we will see you next week apparently so let's do it <laughs> awesome we'll see you next week thank you so much brian goodbye um and would any of you like to stick around and go through the super chats or would you like to go yes. and, and spend your nights with your loved ones Should, are we did sorry do we, oh, are, we gonna, are we gonna announce thingy or are we gonna say say that till next week Oh, the, the hair? Absolutely. Yeah. Let's announce it now. Uh, so what we shall do is uh, we shall say uh, that on Re on Quizzlemania 4, tune in next week. Quizzlemania 4, we are going to see uh, there will be uh, four uh, people taking part, but there will be another screen at Quizzlemania 4. That screen will be taken up entirely <laughs> by <laughs> Randy, Andy Datsun, shaving his head live on camera looking into the future during the quiz look at your future boy <laughs> i mean if i just do that you can kind of you can kind of see where this is uh, going yeah and just say um that's a nice boat georgie <laughs> <laughs> hey george hey, um that's nice yeah. boat you got there, so I, I can i can i say something quickly you absolutely can yeah so i uh i thought that as this is a, a kind of we we obviously these shows raise a bit of money um so i thought that while i'm shaving my head next week um which is always going to be the plan um i will any money you donate during that period will go straight to uh, the nhs uh, covid-19 relief fund um because those guys are effing heroes and they deserve absolutely everything um so yeah we will be giving any money donated during that period um to that fund um and i will be going completely bald um i will be going in steps of baldness every time adam throws to me so i hope you tune in to see that and uh, if you've got a few pennies to spare that would be very much appreciated thank you so much andy yeah well done mate um i'm very big of, very big of you to say that uh you'll go completely bald so you're gonna like big you know, bit crazy, the, your full head. So I mean, grow I'm going to, Ollie, can I, at all. can I, you, can you, he's back. Hey, hey, hey. Hey. I just, I, I forgot my phone. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I just, I just quickly uh, DM Brian asking if he wanted to go through the super chats with us. And Brian said, sure. So Ollie, we're going to go through in, them as a group. Is there money in the budget to buy me a hair trimmer? Because I haven't got one. <laughs> uh, the, uh, there's money in the budget, but you what? won't get one. Trust me. <laughs> I've been trying to get one. You, I've got. Uh, can I we not? Got, can we not leverage? What, what's your ball shaving company called? I've got Manscaped. beard. I've got, I've got yeah, beard Manscaped. trimmers. Yeah, I, I use beard trimmers and then me. use a beard trimmer. Okay, that's what I'll do. All right, gang. Um, are you ready I, to I've, go through some? I've, uh, I've got chat? news in the morning, so I'll uh, I'll head off. I'll tuck Fair in for enough, the night. Ollie. All right. So just just the four of us. Goodbye, Ollie. Bye. 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 There we go. All right. So uh, Ryan Morhini says NHS worker here. Thank you so much. Uh, Thank just you, Ryan. Home, just home enjoying the show. Thanks for getting me through my shift. I'm hoping for an Ollie underdog win. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, dear. Also, love you, Adam. Rainbow emoji. Uh, 
Maca DK says, a recent pledge hammer. Thank you so much. Uh, been a fan of you all for years. And uh, Adam, any chance you will bring back your old cartoon wrestling diaries? Used to love those. Uh, perhaps. Uh, not probably for the immediate future, but we'll see what the future holds. I, I really love doing them. They were my favorite thing to do. So we'll see. Uh, R. Jennings says, I saw a CBW t-shirt on WrestleTalk merch for 500 quid. Did you? You're not supposed to be able to find that. Um, but never mind. We'll. Uh, I'll get rid of that link. Don't worry. Uh, <laughs> A friendly reminder that Titus O'Neil can't believe what he just saw. Hey, a different Titus O'Neil meme. Uh, keep up the good work, lads. Great fun, this. Um, JJ Winwood says, it's my sister Ashley's birthday Sunday. Can you guys Ooh. say happy birthday? No, happy birthday, birthday don't sing it. Let's not, let's not <laughs> All right, sing it again. so we're just going to say it on three. Happy. Three. happy. No, on three. <laughs> you guys. Three, two, one. Happy, happy birthday. birthday. <laughs> no, Andy, stop. Thomas Hollier says, Ollie's hairline has reminded me to watch Robocop during the lockdown. Uh, much love, almost as much as Titus O'Neil has for his son's lips. Uh, classic AJ, thanks for keeping things light, fellas. Uh, Jakey Boy Animation has been watching both Adam and Brian for a long time with Wrestle Talk. Adam, would you ever do a rebooking of WWE CW? Oh, God, I don't know if I. That's a lot. That's a that lot of a, stuff. That's a big plate. I don't know if I've got the <laughs> stomach for it. Uh, Ronts Rajan says, Brian winning this one for the great US of A, baby. USA. USA. <laughs> Where's Mute, Jim? Mute him. Him. Mute him. Yeah. <laughs> Free healthcare. Mm. Yeah, I know. Right. Eli says, uh, Datsun316 says, I just lost my hair. It sure does. Uh, Adam, you should fancy book the T's new evolution with Triple H and Kevin Owens. Uh, Lucas Costa says, hell yeah, Zane. Cheers from Brazil. Again, so all, all them soccer balls, man. This, so, so what's the deal with you in Brazil, Brian? I don't know. I'll have to check my, uh, I'll have to check my stats, my analytics, and see how many viewers I have in Brazil because there might be an untapped market <laughs> to do some Brazilian-themed <laughs> programming. I mean, I really want to see that market. T-search. Huge in Brazil. Huge in Brazil, yeah. Um, <laughs> Ethan Carter says, Joe, 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 he's gone. Adam, please rebook the Ultimate Warrior versus Hogan in WCW. Can't. It was perfect. Uh, <laughs> uh, Death, uh, Death Envoy says, glad you're back, Adam. All, always enjoyed your rebookings back in the day and was ecstatic to see you back. As a side, last season of No Rolls Bard was absolutely brilliant. Can't wait for season two. Thank you so much. Uh, no Rolls Bard will be back as soon as we can all get in the same room. Uh, Barry Marie says, Zane is out here executing order 1776 on the w on the wt lads hashtag murica <laughs> usa, <laughs> USA. Gross. <laughs> uh, jeff Lowe uh, says tlc2 electric boogaloo jay simpson says bz for sheezy oh that's, that's, my, that's my name that's my name <laughs> thank you <There> it is. <laughs> The amount of uh, Brian Zane love in this chat. I'm I'm glad you won because, yeah, we could do with you back next week. Um, Teela Gaming Channel says, favorite wrestling game. All right. Uh, we have something for the group. Favorite wrestling game. I'm going to start us off. Um, I am. So Actually, you know what? Not. Uh, I'm going to say WWE 2K12, the one with the Attitude Era. Mm -hmm. um, 12 or 13. Ooh, whichever whichever one was the one with the Attitude Era showcase I, mode, I absolutely I absolutely love that. That was brilliant. What about you, Andy? Uh, I've never had a two K game, so SmackDown, shut your mouth. That's a good one. Good one. Good one. Uh, Laurie, SmackDown two or No Mercy? And I almost went with No Mercy, Brian. I would say No Mercy or Revenge because that is also it's an underrated game. Which one's Revenge? WCW. NWO, yeah, WCW vs. NWO Revenge. Oh, mm. I remember WCW versus NWO World Tour. Was there a different one? Yes, Revenge was yeah. the sequel. World Tour is the game that got me into professional wrestling. Like, no way. Yeah, that's the game but that I got. But Revenge was the game that came before No Mercy, right? Like, it was the same it engine, was, same it was WrestleMania 2000. It was WrestleMania World Tour, Revenge, WrestleMania 2000, No Mercy. Ah, uh, yeah, okay. Uh, Brett Klazik said, take my uh, network money. So grateful to have a lovely time with the boys every week. Side note, Brian, using Scott Steiner math, how would you, how long will you be champion of Quizzlemania using well, Scott I, Steiner math? I think I've got 141 and two thirds chance percent <laughs> of making it past next week, but don't, don't quote me on that. 
Dal Daltanian said they uh, they could tally the scores as Brian versus Wrestle Talk at this point, and Brian would still probably win. <laughs> if you added all the Wrestle Talk scores together, I think they might have. You would have been on it. Yeah. Uh, Grant says Laurie is my spirit animal. Your spirit animal is on the toilet. Uh, Edward Burke says Adam, any chance of you reviewing Lucha <laughs> Underground R.I.P. Now that you revert, uh, maybe. I it, I honestly I don't know if there'll be that big of an audience for it because it is after all cancelled now. Uh, Wrestling Talk Sign Guy, after hearing Luke talk about uh, how Ollie is taking care of the boys during this pandemic, I up my Patreon from five dollars to twenty five dollars. I want to oh, support thanks, that. Man. Thank you so much. That's great. Kid Campbell says it wouldn't be wrestling if I didn't start a USA chant to upset the foreign heels. USA, 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 go Zane. <laughs> well, actually, because of uh, I'm the, I'm the the guest here. If anything, like you should be chanting like England at me or something. I'm like, no, no, no we yeah, we're going to sing Bindaloo. Yeah. <laughs> you are definitely the foreign menace um the unstoppable monster heel uh teela gaming channel loser gets titus kisses son on the lips tattoo uh cj c garbo says uh loser gets tattooed all of the bad tattoos from today let's go zane uh lloyd perry amazing to see blompier and zane together again even better without grim's toy show nowhere near it that's cruel i really like grim he's a that's really nice guy, guy. um uh, Jamie v uh, Veligas says, Ollie, you and Luke are the greatest man. Over the last few years, WWE has been so awful. I seriously look forward way more to your guys' reviews, slash news, slash podcasts, etc. than I do anything WWE puts out. Thank you again. Thank you so much for a kind pledge. Uh, Neil Sinden Smith says, thanks for the laughter when I'm at home while my wife is in hospital with our twins who were born oh. yesterday. Oh, congratulations. Whoa. Congratulations. Name them after me and Laurie. Yeah, the, Datsun well, and Luke, Blake. Luke, Luke, two losers. <laughs> Randy and yeah, Randy name and them Brian and Brian, and then you'll be good. <laughs> Or Brian and Zane. <laughs> uh, Neil Kennedy says, "Stop burying the milkman." I mean, if he rolled better, the milkman buried himself. Jamie says, "Much love to everybody else, Pete, Andy, Laurie, etc." Uh, hey, Adam, do you still talk to the cultaholic lads and to everyone else? Take care and stay safe. Yeah, I still talk to uh, them occasionally, uh, especially uh, keep in touch with Adam. Uh, Andrew Mayer, final Jeopardy type question: Is catch up ability? No, no, sir. Uh, will Brian do another review on the terrible XFL? I don't know. Well, the XFL this time it wasn't as bad. They didn't make the same mistakes they did last time, and it, they were only undone because of uncertain times. So we didn't get to see how the XFL turned out. I think it would have been a different ending, a different story with the new XFL had everything gone the way you know gone on according to plan. So I don't know if I'll do an XFL two review. Maybe kind of like, oh, this is sad. <laughs> Thank you <laughs> for a while. Uh, just so I realize, like I, I, while Brian is here, being so kind as to donate his time to uh, to go through these super chats, I'm just going to pop your details up there, Brian. So Thank please, you. everyone, go and follow at Zman Brian Zane on Twitter, and make sure you subscribe to Wrestling with Regret. It's a fantastic channel. Uh, if you'd like to see uh, me and Brian in a video, uh, video, a, a nice place to start would be our joint review of the Heroes Legends or Heroes of Wrestling. Heroes of Wrestling. That was uh, wrestling. one of my faves I ever did. Um, partly because I had you and James Mitchell involved in stuff, and just because it was, it was something that needed to be talked about was Heroes of Wrestling. So, uh, if anyone was going to do that one with me, I'm glad it was you. Oh, thank you, man. I've had a great time doing it. And yeah, uh, make sure. Uh, and also, I'm just noticing your subtitle, Brian, here to put all you fool ass bitches on blast. Well, that was a de that was fate that turned out to be destiny. Uh, <laughs> Adam Davison says, part of the Zane fan club, but love to all you guys. What a time to be alive. Quite so. Uh, Mike Dempsey, I know it's not a work, but I'm secretly hoping Drake Maverick wins the CWC and tours other promotions like Jay Lethal did in ROH. Great job, Brian. Great job, Brian. Uh, Lincoln uh, says, anyone still know if the Piston Cup has been called off yet? Got tickets to the grand event and me and my girlfriend are absolutely gutted. Piston Cup, is that a reference I'm not getting? Oh, look it up. Do Piston so, Piston Cup is a song by Randy Newman. Okay. <laughs> uh, Der Darby Jack says, Laurie, could you flush one out for the Fallen Streaks, please? Andy. One step ahead of you. <laughs> uh, Andrew Buchan says, good job, Z-Man. Clap times five. Good job, Z-Man. Uh, Benis Benisato uh, says, I will donate for every point Andy gets. Uh, oh, and has donated 64 bucks because that's your score. Your final score as Quizzlemania. Well, I'm glad I got a few points. Another one. <laughs> 
Uh, Pizza Slice says, great to see you back in the community, Adam. I dare you to invite the PA sensation Greg Cherry to Quizzlemania. Ask Brian or Adam Rift about him. Lol? Yeah, uh, Greg Cherry uh, has his, uh, <clears throat> I think he's with NoDQ.com. Yeah, he has his own trivia thing. And um, when I said at the top of this show, I'm not, I've never won these trivia things. It's because I went against Greg Cherry. So he might actually know more than yours truly here. So if you bring him on, it might get even more intense. Oh, my God. A real clash. Uh, veto. Veto. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so we've got a Flame Inc. says, Zane, please do more stories from the invasion. Uh, yeah, <laughs> maybe one day I'll continue that series that was meant to go in Wrestle Talk. Whoops, life got in the way. Uh, Seth Amphetamines says it's so dope to see someone I love before Wrestle Talk. Now with the group of goons, uh, lovely time with the boys. Keep up the consistently consistent content, and I will continue to support Wrestle Talk. Uh, ZWS Pitcher says the Beast, the Beast has slain the Andy Taker. It has. Uh, how do you? How, how are you feeling, Andy? I mean, obviously, there's um, a full. There's a week to go before you lose your hair. Are you going to uh, spend? Are you going to spend this time with your hair? Are you going to have like a really nice week, like Homer and the Blowfish, just like a list of things to do with your hair? Uh, this is the conversation I've had uh, with my girlfriend. I'm sorry, she says. Did you lose? And I said I was second. Our special guest won by forty points. He's insane. She said, my friends are very excited, but I am not. I'm not happy, and you're not coming near me. Wow. <laughs> well, you're not anyway. You've got three weeks, so it's No, fine. I know, exactly. I said, I said, you know. I said, I know. Don't worry. My head grows very quickly. You're not going to see me for a while anyway. If you could create a Zoom background in which you have hair. Yeah, that's a good idea. That's a great way to get around it. Uh, but yeah, no, thankfully, my head does grow very quickly, so I should, shouldn't be too, what, like too a little, long. Like a little Play-Doh person. You push yeah, if I, just, if I hold my nose and blow, it just goes... <laughs> <laughs> he's like one of those kind of weird little plants you used to get like if you water it it just kind of like moss just grows out of those little holes mm. like that mm. uh chitaran jan says hello from sweden i want to see an adam versus adam predictions contest for ollie's jacket please make it happen the jacket does have to come home uh flame inc says also bald randy will become randy anti corbin <laughs> <laughs> There's your nickname right there. Uh, C2KYD yeah. said, I'd buy a Quizlemania game card just so you... Uh, I'd buy a Quizlemania card game just so you know. Uh, <laughs> I don't have that kind of time. Though it's been said many times, many ways. Welcome back, Adam. Great to see you back on our screens again. Loving these quizzes. Great job, lads, says CM Bala. DJ the Animator says, Zane, Ollie, and Adam got me into wrestling. Thanks. Thank you. Um, Flame Inc. says, Brian couldn't invade what culture. Now he's trying to invade Wrestle Talk this time around. First parts fun known. Next step, Wrestle Talk. Uh, Lucas Costa says the only thing wrestling related uh, people know about Brazil is that one time Jericho murdered our flag lol thanks for the laughs guys uh, Eddie Road Dog says you guys are awesome love WT and Zane's channels also uh, future rebooking video Ask is 2018 when she should have won at Mania 34 it did all go downhill from there uh, Eva Martinez says love you guys glad to see you regularly Adam and that is Ooh. it that is our super chats and that is Quizzle Mania. Uh, I want to say thank you uh, to Laurie. Uh, may I have a celebratory flush from you, sir, as a goodbye gift? Yeah, all right, fine. Thank you. Um, thank you to Andy for putting your hair on the line and especially for doing it for a great cause. So tune in next week to see Andy be emboldened uh, during the quiz. And... <laughs> Uh, once again, thank you so much to our amazing special guest. Came in, uh, burnt it down, and salted the earth. Brian Zane, <laughs> thank you so much. Our thanks, new, thanks for having me. Our new Quizomania champion. Amazing. Uh, that is the end of Quizomania. We'll see you all next week. Goodbye, folks. Goodbye. <laughs>